I'm gonna, we oh. need to start doing that thing where you move your lips and then talk like a, way yeah, like afterwards. Those kung fu movies, yeah, those yeah. kung fu dubs. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what's going on, guys? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, it's really f with him. Yeah, yeah that'd be great. He already loves his job. He loves it so much. <laughs> you think? That's somebody's mother. <laughs> Come on, mom. You get to ride on the hog. That bitch got a Nintendo. What the f? And Pikmin. Oh my god. <laughs> I was with two dudes. It felt good. You know, they fucking like crazy over there. I'm a little sweetheart. I'm a little, I'm a little angel. <laughs> Call me back after payday, dumbass. <laughs> Viewers, help! Oh, yeah. Eat it! Eat it! It's a story casserole! Yeah. I like the taste. Yeah. But we shouldn't start with that, because that'll be later. i will be like <laughs> midway through. Um, um, mm. It's episode. It's an episode. 89. And? Stalt, thank you. Yeah, thank stalt, you. Put, it, yeah put it right there. For the layup. Awesome. Um, oh. It's our first one back with just us three in a while. You guys look absolutely fucking zoinked. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. No, dude, sure we're, we'll be we're shifting it up. Yeah, you, good look, you look paralyzed. You look, yeah. I, got a, I got a headrest in my chair, and uh, oh, this, is, this shit's aftermarket. Herman Miller doesn't make a headrest for their chairs because they say He's that all, all our testing has indicated that headrests make you a lazier person. And so they want, these are supposed to be productive working man chairs. And so I, I immediately got a headrest and I've fallen asleep in my chair twice. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I definitely buy, I definitely Yo, buy the science. Yeah. But anyways, if like it looks like I'm going to nod off something. or anything, like feel free to wake me up. It's not going to happen though. You look like a quadriplegic with that headrest. Look at that. Yeah. I don't just, buy I'm that like though. I'm just going to lean back a little bit. Because if they oh, wanted to man. make the ultimate like working man's chair, it'd have like a toilet hole in it it'd have like yeah. massage legs it'd have all a machine to pinch you yeah you stay a little pinching yeah. machine you, a little you, zappy yeah you seen that movie THX 1138 or whatever it's like a future That's movie crazy. and like this no, yeah. this Sounds flashlight like comes movie. from the ceiling and wait, jacks uh, this guy off yeah, okay wait what's this while he's working no 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 it, it's like so it's like a future dude this movie rocks it's um one minute it's, in. No, no. George yeah, Lucas yeah. made it, I think. <laughs> oh, shit. And and That's it's like... From Star Wars. Yeah, it's like my favorite movie that he's made. Oh. And... Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right, okay. Oh, no, no, I uh, seriously... I think it was George Lucas. Either that or it's another one that's like... I don't believe you. Um, if it's not him, then I fucking hate his guts. Yeah, he's never made a good movie. I think it's a George Lucas movie, but well, I have no idea. I've just never it. heard of it. What's it called? THX 1138. Yeah, it's director that's George so, Lucas. A screenplay by him as well. Interesting. But what anyway, um, 1971. Damn. Yeah. Oh. And it's like a like a future dystopian movie, right? Like 1984. But everybody has to take like these like emotion suppressant pills or some bullshit. It's kind of like Equilibrium that movie, but minus the gunplay or anything. And uh, this guy stops taking his emotion pills, and he actually like experiences emotion or something, and. But one of the things that they do, like everything's because everything's ran by the government, the dudes are supposed to come home and then they sit down on this couch and they just play like this looping video of a black lady dancing naked. And when like and, and then a flashlight comes down from the ceiling and like sucks them off. And then and the government's like, that'll keep you calm. <laughs> this will, every day yeah, you get your dick sucked while looking at like Grace Jones dancing on the tube. I wouldn't Is it hurt. always the same lady every time? Same I, I mean, video? they don't show the guy getting jacked off every night. I just assume it's a nightly <laughs> thing. Because he, he kind of went well, to the couch. And he's just like, all right, honey. I'm like, I'm sitting down for my milking. Uh, yeah. I mean, that would, couldn't hurt if we had one of those in every Honestly, house. Yeah. The and Republicans are always like, talking about videos? smaller government and stuff, but I'm all about this big government if they give us <laughs> ceiling suck-me-off machines. Certain, uh, that would be awesome. Benefits, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That could be cool. Fuck. Uh, oh, dude, you know this doesn't apply to you, uh, Brian, but who <laughs> and the audience uh, that are American... They're, oh, they're like American looking memes. at approving. This is going to sound lame at first, but think about it for a second. Uh oh, they're, they're approving 40 year mortgages. Oh, for, instead of like the standard 30. Like they're yeah, approving. I, I actually don't know what this you, you're going to have to dive more into this to see. Does this benefit or hurt me? 
considering by the end of a 30 year mortgage, you pay like usually almost like the price of the house in interest. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. So over worse. a 40 year period. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's way worse. Okay. It's way worse. It also probably I'm, you know, I'm no economist. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, but I would assume it would make like housing prices are going to do nothing but go up. If you can go yeah. out and get a loan for lower payment, you know, but, um, uh. Yeah, so if you're in the audience and you're under the age of 30 or whatever and you you think in the future you're going to buy a house with a little white picket fence and you're going to have that American dream, <laughs> pack it up, boys. Yeah. It ain't happening. Get yeah. your head out of the fucking clouds, dude. Renting ain't that bad, okay? Uh, mm-hmm. uh, they take I, yeah, care of your sucks. lawn sometimes at rental places. I'm pretty sure it's oh. already established I'm not getting my parents' house. I think one of my siblings is getting that. What? So. You guys should fight to the death for it or something. Uh, That's not fair. No, no, no. They get what? it. They get everything. And now I want her car. It's like my big, like, I want that. <laughs> and they've already established we have to play rock, paper, scissors to see who gets it. So. Uh, but damn, not they are, yeah, it's they are cool. picking favorites. What the hell? Have I told I mean, you about random. mine and my brother's horrible? Like we we had that same thing where we had like agreed on things yeah. that we would take. Yeah, yeah, you, you, you've discussed this. I can't totally remember it, but I'm sure everyone in the comments will. But go ahead and say it again. Well, my yeah. uh, my I was like, hey, I'll take I'll get the house that we grew up in, and my brother was like, okay, I want my mom's like antique collection, oh, yeah, with all yeah. those vases. And then my mom fucking lost the house in the 2008 financial crisis. Yeah. yeah tough she break. foreclosed on it. You don't get oh like any <laughs> like slack from your brother. No, that. dude. You're he's just like, like, no. Like he took a bad trade, man. Yeah. Uh, bad man. deal. I saw that. <laughs> Live in your house right now, dude. You yeah, can't... that's the other cheap part. I can't even yeah. the market high. I can't sell my fucking house. He's squatting in it. <laughs> Oh, this man. guy just keeps fucking me over. He's gonna have all my mom's collectibles in my house. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fuck that. You should make him start eating your own shit or something. In those <laughs> yeah, it's really so funny. Yeah. Or else you're gonna lock him out. Yeah, yeah. 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 Fuck. <laughs> just like uh, wait, wait, you said they're like vases or something. Yeah, they're yeah. they're. How much are they worth? They're not even Millions. worth anything, dude. It a was like hundred bucks. Yeah, my mom. Yeah. Okay, this was like the the beginning of eBay. I think the house. I think that you probably deserve to get fucked there because what a rotten deal your brother was. <laughs> yeah, doing. yeah. Well, I thought this guy sucks at business. If he's willing to take some goddamn vases, <laughs> no, no, he was actually the cool? wise as fuck. He yeah, These he are knew. McCoy vases, right? I see I don't... the trends. Two thousand eight will be a disaster. <laughs> yeah. He's like the Big Short, and uh, uh, my mom would get them off eBay. Back when eBay was in its infancy, she would run in there to the the Hewitt Packard and kick me off a of Diablo and go, "I need to That's check on my <laughs> on my auctions for my blue I turquoise totally that, McCoy vase." They worth a shitload. I do a lot of bidding for all of these, so I respect that. Um, yeah, I, I, like, I don't know if they're worth anything. I I honestly don't. They don't seem like they're particularly well made or anything like that. <laughs> yeah. They're just like poured plastered like vases. I don't know. Like they, it's not like they're hand like spun on a wheel with love. Like somebody's ceramics. You know, these oh, are poor. Yeah, nah, for sure. These are poor dog shit. <laughs> I have no respect yeah, for them. I, I wonder why your brother wanted those. Uh, he looked around the house. He said, "Okay, you get the house. I'll get something else of value." And that was the only thing. He, yeah, oh, that was the only I thing he could determine. Thirty rack in the fridge. Yeah. He was like, I'm going to guess that uh, the house is probably going to disintegrate from the roof leak that's had for the past five years yeah, uh, before these McCoys crumble or whatever. So he Ouch. he probably, yeah, he definitely got out on top there. Oh, yeah, he was smart. Man. Yeah. Now you just need your mom to die so you can get those vases. Yeah. You collect those well, vases, yeah. And then all... Pretty yeah. big payout, yeah. Once, once it's all gone. coming together for Zach. He gets she, everything. Yeah. She lives with your grandma, right? Yeah. Well, why are you, like, doxing oh, my whole family? Yeah, what the hell? Damn, dude. Yeah, she lives know, with my I grandma. I didn't dox your whole family. So now I'm just going to say, who gets that house? Oh, uh, I guess when my grandma dies, uh, my mom would get it. And then I told mom, <laughs> sell it. No, <laughs> immediately. you own a house. Hey, that's true. House this house is a way upgrade, yeah. though. No, okay. Mm. This I don't. I don't know if this is doxing information, but this is such a weird thing. I there's a lot it's of things just personal, that I, I guess. Yeah, yeah, it's personal. There's a lot of it's things that I, I really did like in my grandfather's character, and he was like a real like morally and ethically good guy. 
But he was also just like weird. He would just choose the hard path 99% of the time. Yeah. And there was this company that was getting demolished. Like it was just some like little business and they were going to tear it down and make a bank. And he just, this is like the type of guy he is where he's just like, I found a, think of him like, like Saul Goodman. You know, where he would just like come up with a scheme, like, like really immediately. Morally good guy. No, but like yeah. he was like business minded. Oh, you yeah. know, he was a lot yeah. like that. He's and he's like Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Yeah, he basically <laughs> saw like a wrecking ball outside of this building, came scrambling up and goes, "Stop the wrecking ball! Are you demolishing that house?" And the guy's like, uh, "Yeah." And he's like, "How much do you want for it?" <laughs> And he's like, well, we need it gone by Monday. He's like, if you've mentioned that, you yeah, take the whole house. He, takes, yeah. he fucking takes it and like pays some company to like just tear down yeah. all the, the, the lines, <laughs> the telephone lines and power lines and shit. And, and like just drive this house through town and dumped it on a lot. And then he also turned it 90 degrees, built steps and a porch up the front. He built a, um, a garage and everything. And then um, yeah, it seems like a pretty good scam. He got the yeah, rest he of got the house. basically like a free house, and he just had to pay the insane fees for moving it across town, yeah. which yeah. kind of like evened out a little bit. But then he just totally reconfigured the house, which would cost like hundreds of thousands now. But the house is like, like I don't know if you've ever read like Devil in the White City. It's about that serial killer H. H. Holmes, yeah. and he he constructed like this hotel during the the chicago world's fair and what he would do is he was like a serial killer and so he wanted to kill people in his hotel so he, he made sure it was intentionally hard to escape and convoluted in the layout and he would hire like a crew of construction workers to work on it. and like a week into their construction job he would fire them so he didn't have to pay them he'd be like you fucked everything up and then he would bring on a new crew and so nobody had like the full scope of what was going on there but he had basically plumbers like hook up like gas lines that directly dumped into people's rooms so he could just gas them out while they were sleeping. And, uh, uh, and yeah. like people you mentioned this. Before. Yeah, that, that guy's fucking weird. But anyways, I just imagine this house <laughs> is a lot like that guy's like uh, a hotel. Murder like that, hotel. Yeah, yeah, there's just like weird little turns and corners and stuff where you could tell <laughs> this isn't the intended layout of this place. Yeah, but cool, my though. kids love it because it's like a fun house. They're just like, yeah. ah! Like, look at these <laughs> look at these Scooby Doo little passageways yeah. Yeah. that if you're aren't an like intruder, cool. You would have no yeah. idea. An intruder that would be the perfect place to put it, like punji sticks and shit, because yeah. there's just some oh, avenues Looney that Tunes nobody house. takes in the yeah. house, you know. Yeah, great for a Home Alone situation. I'm glad though yeah. to hear like, you know, oh my grandpa, my grandpa who I like really look up to, and he's like this morally just figure, you know. I had a grandpa like that, so I thought. Then I just went on a family vacation in Florida. Oh, a lot of things got unboxed when oh, you know you no. get drunk with your dad. And uh, yeah, one night I'm just like, we're just getting wasted, you know, sitting out on the porch. You know, beautiful weather. As you do, as you do. Yeah, and you know, it's like the grandpa I've talked to before that I had ALS, and like he's always like in my eyes as a kid, like he's like my cool grandpa. Like he played video games. And my, what I had to compare him to my other grandpa who died, you know, is the guy that was like a total Kentucky, like, I don't know, maybe he's actually an angel, but all I've heard are bad things yeah, about him. And he's like a douchebag and he calls my brother pisshead and all this stuff. And like, I never met him, but he was like really scary guy. And this grandpa's like, cool. You know, he does, he plays video games, he likes Lord of the Rings and all this stuff. And like, I always just had this really like high, like. Oh, well, I'm like my dad, and my dad's probably like his dad because he loves movies and video games and stuff. I'm like, oh, it's like just this line down. And I brought up something to my dad, and I just saw him like, Ugh. and my stepmom like docks basically about, I think I asked something, like I kind of brought it up where like, it's like, I'm pretty sure he like cheated on my original grandma. I'm like, is that real? And they're like, oh, I don't know about that. And then it just like unboxed into this, like, actually he was a horrible person. And like, my dad had like a really traumatic childhood that I had no idea uh -huh. of. And it was like, started crying. It was like, I had a really rough. And I'm like, holy fuck. Like, I thought it was like peaches and cream over there. Cause it's just how you, my yeah, dad's just like fuck? a goofy guy. Like, yeah. you know, jokes around a lot and stuff. It's always the funny ones. And, uh, yeah, I basically was like, oh, fuck, my grandpa was like an asshole. It's like maybe one of the <laughs> yeah. worst people. Yeah. You know, maybe this guy deserved that. I was always like, why God? Why him? Why that ALS? Yeah. I'm like, maybe, maybe it's a good thing. I don't know. Like, maybe. And like, yeah, it was just really, it was sucked to hear because I'm like, there's so few people in my family where I'm like, that's a cool person. 
like in the older generation. Yeah. And then, yeah, I heard all that. I'm like, oh, fuck. But I had a really good time. Like, my dad and I, you know, grew definitely a little closer. You know, you learn more about them, what makes them tech and stuff. So that's cool. When you, especially like those times when you, you become a man and then you're treated <sighs> like a man by your yeah, dad. True. Yeah, and you, okay. you go out like drinking or, or smoking with them or whatever. Those are that is kind of an interesting dynamic to all of a sudden feel. Uh, Brian, you just close your eyes and imagine. Can't really, yeah, yeah. Can't relate to that can't one. Can't relate yeah. to that. I can but, uh, Hey, yeah, throw on a little rice. Groucho Marx outfit on yeah. your mom and go fucking light one I've up with her. Uh, hey, uh, mom. Uh, I've yeah. seen it in movies, though. So <laughs> I, I, it it's I such a, when like all of a sudden it's very much not son father when it's just like two dudes. But Two that's kind of yeah. all. Like, Imagine. my dad even said when we were talking about it, he's like, this is how you've always been. And it's so weird. Like, I caught myself a lot when I was there. Like, I really do act like a totally different person. Like, that's why, you know, I don't, I'm always like, I don't want my family to see the podcast. Like, I act a different so different. Or whatever. Yeah, around my parents. And, like, I don't know. I, I just act so. <laughs> Your face like, of concern, Sam. You still don't believe that. They, I don't. Yeah. What, what, no, no, no. I, I, I do a hundred percent because yeah. I do have a. I don't uh, know you. I feel like you act the exact same in public too, Sam. Even though you're a fucking. Oh, oh Sam. No, yeah, no. I have my family. My like my so, my. I feel you don't, like, uh, I, I really my grandma like, and everything. It's not yeah. like I act like fakey with them. It's just like it <clears> is how I feel a lot. Like I, I just you know I play different parts or whatever. You know, a little like Two Face or the Joker. And but it's like I'm just so like he's always like you've always been like a mature like little like you've been so act so old since you're a kid and I'm like Jesus Christ like you do not like see how I act <laughs> when I put on that headset or whatever and I don't know we just had some like really really deep talks about my childhood too and stuff and it was cool to hear yeah it's like it is uh you definitely see when it's like more an adult adult relationship like it's noticeable and like i think i had a hard time transitioning into that with my mom where it's like oh my god like we gotta both just like you know we gotta be adults here like we yeah. you know you, I, i'm a, i'm a person now yeah well with my dad it's like we've always we've not i don't think my dad and i have ever argued or anything like we just you know we, we, we don't really worry about the little stuff like we, we keep it real with each other but like also uh, you know we <laughs> it's don't been really so put, nice to talks. know that like when i'm on the phone with my parents like they can't and they don't expect to tell me to do anything yeah you know what i mean like they're like you old no sway well, I over here i don't have i've learned the word mom. no yeah. <laughs> like I, i'll just say like nah i'm not doing that shit and that is to convince you to do shit all the time oh, dude, guilty, it was like a big no yeah they would do a huge guilt trip they're like oh you're My not gonna like really slave away trips. for free at our property and i'm like no what? i'm not fuck yeah. you no, <laughs> i get true. paid by the, the amount of time i work now i don't but Not I definitely doing like doing that shit. it's so weird, yeah. like my family dynamics. Like when I'm with my dad and them, I'm like, God, like I'm so you know, I got so drunk when I, everyone's like fucking crying talking. I'm like, oh God, like I really should visit more. Like they're like, No, you've got a life, like it's whatever. Like any time's good, like you don't worry about it. Like go move somewhere else, do whatever. It's like I talk to my mom, and it's like, if you move out of this state, I'll kill myself and I'll kill the family. <laughs> but it's not like my mom, I actually I love my mom. Like we have a we have a good relationship, but it's like the level of like how they act with me is so different also. And then how I act with each of them. And then I'm like, who, who the, uh, you know, it's like, I was out there looking at the stars. Like, who am I? And what do I, what, like, what values do I hold? It sucks. It's weird. It's like, uh, I don't know. It's like, do I just show them the podcast? Do I just be like, check this out. And then it's like, Reveal do I your weight identity. lift it off? Or am I like, am I even, am I more like this person that I am with them? normally and then i you know it's just like uh it's just an odd like i i don't know i it's like uh split between two worlds with my family and my online community mm. but it's Your not three like families, i families you mean yeah my three, three families yeah, yeah. and i don't really families. have a bad time with any of them so you have a preferred let's, family let's between, get these good yeah. times rolling yeah what's your favorite family yeah between my online family of subs uh my mom <laughs> and my dad yeah yeah not really. I also am like a very indecisive person. I never pick favorites. I think that has something to do with like childhood. So if uh, all of your parents. subs yeah. were hanging off a cliff and then your yeah, mom was your also hanging This is like the, the trolley yeah. problem. Oh, man. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Who'd you? Who'd I'd you? definitely <laughs> save my mom because, oh, Dude, my God. You're going to lit all those five, people? 
500 uh, brave souls. Uh, the shit I'd get from my goddamn siblings if I let what my mom were, die. <laughs> oh my god, I would never hear the end of it. If I let all those subs die, my no one would ever know. Yeah. You know, they're probably yeah. cretins. And, you I know, would know. A good yeah. uh, portion yeah. of what I yeah. assume is our shared community <laughs> yeah. would be yeah, gone. You're directly hurting me. Then. And my, these people, yeah. my social blade. Yeah, but see, <laughs> yeah those people feel don't have like their own lives and backstories and histories. Oh, They're just a yeah. little number in it. They're <laughs> low <laughs> CPU usage. Yeah. They're in the background. Yeah, they no, I don't back know. in the no, simulation. I don't, I don't really have a, a favorite. It was like for different things. You know, it's like I'd want to go to my dad's house for like I want to play online, and then it's like I want to go to my mom's house. I want to loudly yell the N word yeah, through the yeah. house. Gotta yeah, go to my dad's. <laughs> I, we were talking about that too. <laughs> that my dad was talking about how much I used to scream the N word when I was looking. No, oh, like uh, about how like I don't know. Did you guys ever get like left alone a lot when you were a kid? I guess you had an older oh, yeah. brother, but I, yeah, I guess Brian. Yeah, definitely like single oh, parent yeah. shit. Like okay, uh, he was like yeah, but you know, since you were like seven, you would be home alone a lot, and you'd I'd always call him and be like, "Can I have a granola bar?" <laughs> yeah, if you, like you can have a like, tweet. I know he's like, you don't have to call me and ask me. And I call like twenty minutes later, like, can I have an ice cream sandwich? And he's like, yes, you can have it. And he's like, I just had like he just had to work like seven days a week and shit. He's like, I honestly like you were fine though, like you loved it. I'm like yeah. I, you know, I did love that. Like I had a great yeah. time. I would just I just sit there and watch Jurassic Park or fucking Star Wars over and over. That sounds cool, but in the I, I a recently... home intruder came in. And I had to kill him. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Scarred me for life and split me into two people. I watched Home Alone like ten times, yeah. so I got it covered, dude. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, I, I heard this uh, story. My mom was telling me about it's some lady she knew or like her. Uh, it was one of her coworkers. Her fucking niece, I guess, was was left at home at uh, fourteen, which is old oh, yeah. enough, I would think, yeah, to yeah, be yeah. left oh, alone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Bitch that's, chokes that's, on a cheeseburger and dies. Oh God, by I just choke a lot. As that's a kid. horrible. Yeah, and I'm just like, uh, I've wow. always had. You well, I had a choking experience a recently, I, yeah, and but, I and I was like, I don't want to go out just alone choking on a fucking yeah. peanut butter sandwich. By yeah, yeah, in here, what would yeah, you do? Would you try to write a note or something crudely? Or <laughs> yeah. would what'd you, be worse though? <laughs> what if you choked on stream? But nobody could and, like. And you're like, viewers, no, help, help! Yeah. No, I mean, nobody the, yeah. could help. <laughs> he, I mean, I can uh, type it out, right? Like, I'm choking. Yeah, here's yeah. my address. Yeah, like, no, that would take way one. too long. Like, yeah. you could dox like, myself. You call, you call my brother. The number. last thing I see is I'm blacking out. Nightbot <laughs> automatically like scrubs it because they're like, you doxed yeah. yourself. We'll, so we'll yeah. take that for you. Deletes your, my own one message. Of your mods, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Brian deletes well, it. Sam, <laughs> Sam yeah. deletes his Sam long long live the king. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now I get all the patrons. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. No, I, uh, I'm terrified of choking and uh, choking. Death I, yeah, I definitely. I mean, I mean, it fucking sucks. Yeah, I've definitely. I've, oh, geez, here we go again. <laughs> well, no, about okay, movies. just alone no, in a house. It just no, seems something yeah. very preventable, is what I'm saying. No, but no. Yeah. Okay, I've. Uh, yeah. I I hate like every time I hear. It's like I have to retell a story because it's. I think of it when I you say I can't like that. remember like, the story. Yeah, tell I me. choked. Once in front of people, and no one was doing shit, and that was scarier than choking alone. <laughs> because no. my aunt was like, it was like my great aunt and my cousins were at the table, and I was like, <laughs> and I'm like, oh, and I start pounding on the table, and my cousins are just. <laughs> And my great aunt's like, what's wrong, sweetie? Like, do you need some orange juice? And I stood up, I was like, ah, and I went over to the sink. <laughs> And I was like trying to put my stomach on the counter. She's like, what is going on with you? And God bless him, my dad in the other room, he was asleep. He had like a 102 degree fever. Comes in there and like, what's all that? Oh my God. <laughs> and sees him, gives me the Heimlich. I shoot out like raw bacon, like into the sink. I'm like, what the hell? Like what's happening? <laughs> And they were like, oh, he was choking? And I'm doing like the oh, universal, yeah. like, what the fuck? Yeah. And I'm like, oh, did they want me to die? Did What was happening? Like, and that was so, oh, like, great Whoa. if you, like, write down on a piece of paper choking. And they're like, oh, he's yeah. joking. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's, uh, that's joking. Yeah. That's he's our doing little, a little meme. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it was really weird, though. Like, uh, it, it, maybe I could have been more direct. Like, <laughs> but yeah. it was like, how we how is this woman so un unequipped to save me? 
and, and my dad even after that was like, what the hell's wrong with you? Like, what's that? Like, well, my baby. And yeah, it's like, you totally saved my life. And I used to choke all the time though. Cause I just like, I was a fat little kid. <laughs> I just shove shit down my throat like corn. I love cornbread. Couldn't cornbread you can chewing. choke on easy. Oh, easy. Yeah. So if you don't cornbread have a sweet tea is, to wash it, it down, you're it's choking. It's so dry. Yeah, yeah dude. Just, how uh, how uh, south uh, is Indiana? What the hell? Dude, yeah, well, it's right. because my oh my yeah, they, oh yeah, from Kentucky, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, they're, oh, all, they're, they're mountain cornbread. people. They're Appalachian dude, mountain we people. We will tell Abby's like grandma. We'll be like, hey, come on over for dinner. We're making um. Like, I don't know. We're making like spaghetti or something like that. We're just having order out. She will, (laughs) she will come over with fresh fucking cornbread, like, Uh, regardless of the meal. She's like, I mean, cornbread because it just goes with anything. Cornbread's so good, though. Oh, Oh, my God. That's why I wish my, I wish my family, it's like we don't like each other. So we're very like, we get into our own. Yeah, yeah that's family. A, yeah, yeah, that's family. But that's everyone's always like, family. we're a very close family. It's like, I even, I don't see my cousins or aunts or great people, you know, great uncles, aunts, like ever. But when I was a kid, we used to do family reunions. I don't know what happened. Those stopped, you know, somewhere there's some drama happened. But goddamn, it was like sweet potato casserole, homemade chicken and dumplings, cornbread, like oh, all classics. this shit where I just all be like, oh, go, 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 go. <laughs> and like i remember like the old women in the family would always be like man he really like he came up to me he was so sweet like really loved my sweet potato casserole it's like i'm just trying to be like you know anytime you want make some more i'll i'll eat it and I remember, what, kind, like, what kind of sweet potato casserole did it have the, with the fucking brown sugar like oh the brown sugar on melted on top yeah, it where it's like so hard oh you get the yeah. corner piece of that yeah, shit yeah, yeah of course and it's like uh, i don't they put know pecans there was, in it yeah and i don't oh, know if there classic. was marshmallows classic in it or shit. not Nah. I can't remember, but I think no. Yeah, there's like but, the two big ways is yeah. like the marshmallow topping or it wasn't no, that's white trash. This was yeah. awesome. Well. Yeah, this was uh, a little bit also, more sophisticated. Well, when we go to these though, it's <laughs> the like marshmallows always, is the telling point. It's yeah. like I my uh, fam like my subsect of family, it's like God. it's like we it's like we thought we were better or something because we go to these is things. There thinking and like my, or knowing? N- I don't know. Because my, mo- my mom is like a health food There's nut. a lot in there. And then there'd be like know. all my cousins. They're like, our pitching is we're bringing a bucket of KFC. Fuck and yeah. they'd just be like these oh, fat fuck. little monster fuck kids yeah. like yeah. <laughs> eating it up like they got their big gulps. Yeah. And my mom would be like, they show up with eyes. a big gulp, dude. Hell yeah. yeah. I'd, be, I'd be like, oh my, I've never had KFC. Can I try that? And she's yeah. like, absolutely not. You may not try that. That's so fucked and up. Like my, all of my cousins, God, they're going to listen to this. They're like, what <laughs> nah, the fuck, they, dude? They'll love it, man. They'll love it. Yeah, yeah. It's just a bunch it. of fat monsters in that family. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's an oh old guy on uh, like extended family who'd come into town for like funerals and shit. He would always wear the same Hanes color t shirt. I think you're saying And it would always have like grease and ketchup on it. And uh, then for uh, the funeral, he just ha- he got one out of the package. Uh, <laughs> like a brand new, a new one, one and put, put it, it over on. the old one. You <laughs> yeah. see the- he just pulled out a new <laughs> Hanes shirt with a fucking titty Dude, pocket. But it's, it's a like, black one now. When I was a kid, I'm like, oh, these like despicable. But I'm like, they're just really poor. Like, you yeah, know, that's this that guy's family. problem. Like, too. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, well, it's like, well, like we were poor up. too, but we were classy poor. You yeah, know? you gotta, you really gotta class it no, up. Go to Goodwill and buy yeah. a fucking shirt with a collar for Christ's sake. Yeah. Like Two dollars, you can really class yourself up. Yeah. God damn, sure. yeah. You don't have to buy a Hanes pack shirt. You know, yeah. you can get a little bib, put it on, stop that grease. But um, uh, I don't know. A lot of judgmentalness going on in that family. I think. You know, <laughs> well, also, I think there's just some crazy people that's like, yeah, we yeah, don't talk to them. Those little fat kids are also judgmental yeah, too. Yeah. They, no, yeah. no, yeah. we, we yeah. were no, definitely no. judgmental. You gotta lay it on them. We're and angels, like, yeah. and they're always just judging us. Well, and stuff. I feel like we're like, yeah, the actual <laughs> assholes, and like people, like we'd always show up to every function. Uh, this is all my mom's side. Like we'd show up late to everything, and, and they'd be like fucking cleaning up. <laughs> we're like, oh, okay, we made an appearance. Bye. And on out. Dude, and we have those people in my classic, family. We yeah. fucking hate their guts. <laughs> we, I, I straight up will tell my mom, like, it's 30 minutes before it actually is. She'll yeah. still fucking show up late. 
Yeah. Yeah. It, oh. it drives me up. So the those wall. people are your mom. Yeah. <laughs> basically. Family. Well, no, those, we pe- like, we people. also, <laughs> there's also okay, other people in the family, <laughs> too. Call on yourself a uh, little bit. Yeah. Oh, okay. Name yeah. names, dude. I'm yeah, not naming names, man. <laughs> Fat uncle, bitch. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's Abby's dad. He fucking takes yeah, forever, uh, like, pruning himself I, or whatever. I like being, uh, I always like being punctual, and that would drive me crazy, too. Yeah. I'm like, you're, I'm a representative of you, you're a representative of me, mom. Like, you can't, I don't want to show up late. late. Yeah, and be like, oh, yeah, I like seeing my family sometimes. You know, I want to talk to them. Disrespectful. Yeah, you got to show up on time for everything. I talked about this before, too. It's like my entire, it's like a family of old women. That's it. Like, there's <laughs> one, I've got like one or two boy cousins, and then it's like probably 40 old women. Yeah. And it's like every function I go to, it's like I just go and, you know, I hit it off great with them. You know, we gossip. Ever heard of Mahjong? <laughs> yeah. All the yeah. dudes Mahjong. died. Like, it's just me and yeah, my no, brother. So. Yeah, no, that's oh, my kind God. Of, it sucks. My family, they either dipped or died or yeah. expl- <laughs> they were killed. Dogs, they dipped out or, yeah. yeah, there's a couple uh, of Brian's. killings. Yeah, Yo. Brian, you get what that. About, right? What about your? What about your? Like, <laughs> describe your Four Canadian family. No, My your little Canadian family. Uh, Thanksgiving. What's that called? It's called Thanksgiving. Okay. Do you do you go to like extended family? Or no, anything? just me, and my mom, and a turkey. How many or, dishes? I mean, what's the what's the spread two. looking like? <laughs> Oh, uh, we got Dude, turkey. For two fucking we people, got, uh, I would have like turkey, mashed potatoes, yeah. gravy. Yeah, we got, yeah, we got mashed potatoes, gravy, exactly. Uh, and then some other random shit. Like, depends if I want. Like, you know, sometimes I'll make myself some French fries. You know, when I was a little kid, French fries with everything. Uh, but uh, yeah, no, it's pretty depressing. Usually, usually it was a uh, yeah. it was a frozen turkey because my mom uh, can't. Cook you don't have shit, any so extended was... family or anything come over. You don't have a neighbor or anything. Uh, no, it was mostly for it was mostly Christmas. We would have like big family get-togethers. Here I am complaining not about turkey, my big crazy though. fat family. <laughs> not, right? not Some turkey. people don't even have a family. We don't even uh, got a family. No, we, it's only for we Christmas we do that about. shit. Yeah. yeah. You can vent yeah. about your mom if you want. <laughs> yeah, I dude, pretty, honestly, pretty I have stand-up woman. <laughs> I have known yeah. him since like 2010, well, and I don't asked. know his mom's no. name. I don't know what she <laughs> yeah. does for a living. I don't know if if she's that's, even alive. This guy's like Norman Bates, thing. dude. I bet you she's she died like in 2015. Yeah, I'm just collecting her fucking, <laughs> yeah, her social just, insurance yeah. He's got her propped up <laughs> in a room so My that people mother. can see her in the window. Uh, yeah. <laughs> do the fucking uh, weekend and birdies thing. Yeah, yeah. You, go in there, you cut her hair <laughs> and she's just like, <laughs> yeah. uh, she can't move. Uh, well, you know, it's not that far off from the truth. But, you know, that's <laughs> she's, gonna, she's gonna come downstairs one day and be like Kate Upton or something, like yeah, just, super model, uh, to- total bangable mom. <laughs> yeah, uh, that would be awesome. I bet your mom's bangable, Sam, just because she sounds like a drunk <laughs> 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 No. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, I'm so sorry. I don't know. What the fuck? I'm joking. I'm joking. Oh, dude. Oh. My mom's going to hear jo- this. She's going to be no, upset. No. I just She's ran into be- one of my brother. My brother is like. <laughs> okay, so, like, there's one thing. That was like, uncalled for. If someone. Yeah, uncalled for. If someone asked, like, I, I would just be. Yeah, like, I do. Like, I have podcasts. I make video game videos on YouTube. Yeah. But, like, okay. my brother, like, shouts it from the rooftops. He's oh. like, do you know my brother? He's really sweet, actually. But he, he's sweet. like, he's he, he's he, he definitely spreads it around, yeah. And, oh, uh, shit. And so, like, I ran into his fucking co-worker at my daycare. Apparently, he's dropping his kid off. And he's just, like, talking to me about, like, my videos and stuff. Like, he, oh, like, shit. told him all about it and shows him that oh, stuff. That's and so, stupid. and, like, mom knows about you. And she's like, now, which one's Brian? <laughs> and, like... I'm like he's oh, the guy shit. that's like always just staring into the void. <laughs> into the void, yeah. <laughs> like <laughs> he's like staring into the void, and I, the void staring I, I, back. His uh, eyes are always like I got need to be thousand sh- yard stare. Yeah. <laughs> you guys have a family, mom. That's what I'm, I'm, yeah, I got it, dude. I've seen he's looking things, at man. two people. It's astounding. Whoa. <laughs> 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 There's Can people on the monitor. There's more, uh, there's more than my mom I, out there. Communicate. Yeah. <laughs> like a Brian family Christmas. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, how uh, many shows up for Christmas, though? I don't know. Fuck it. Uh, is it like a whole shitload of people, or is it like three people come walking in that door? <laughs> Your big extended family. 
Uh, it would be like, well, it, he, yeah, because my mom is like an only child, but then like my grandma, you know, they fucking like crazy over yeah. there. So they had, there's tons of those. So it's like a lot of, you know, mom's aunts, mom's cousins type oh, shit. Okay. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know. Oh, so, so you're just descended like, from like the one, yeah, the we, one we, lady we, that yeah, couldn't get any. The the, the incel the, yeah. the the incels yeah Fem yeah cell. yeah. <laughs> yeah the fem cells yeah the fem cell and incel together so, so right. but Christmas you know we had we had some people but you know Thanksgiving it's pretty solitary Father's Day you know that's a that's a <laughs> sore subject that's a, that, yeah that's a that, we don't talk about that place it's like that the day, big part you know? of your family is that like over in uh in Portugal uh well doxing yeah is um, that doxing. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Uh, no, because that's not even where technically where I'm from. Okay. But I would say it's like, like, not really. I think a lot of them moved here. Oh, okay. oh. so a bunch of your yeah. family European, like directly. You yeah, like my, well, I know you, you went over there as a and shit. I guess family yeah, union or whatever. yeah, that's yeah. Why, that's like, why I assumed. <laughs> they had grandparents and stuff. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's like a mix. Like, there's a lot of them moved here or U.S. Nice. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What? Well, yeah. Not like no, us, no. purebreds. I, yeah, yeah. I would. I would technically yeah. be a purebred. In a, USA. In a, <laughs> but yeah. Podcast. We, we are. We are a solitary people, and I'm fucking happy about it. All right. I'm proud. Yeah, no, that's yeah. fair. I'm I, proud. No. This is like. Are you happy about drama. it, or is it all you've ever known? You know what? I think. Yeah. It's like a blind man who just like yeah. you know like what you've never I, seen before. So I, it's not a big deal. I do want to ask? So like, is your as mom... opposed to if your whole family got slaughtered? You know, yeah, and you're used to having a big family be a lot worse than if you know my what family happens, got slaughtered. What happens yeah, to yeah, Brian true, when his mom dies? So. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. you're I mean, only I, your I, one I, pillar I, of social I, circle. I, 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 yeah, no, I got friends. I mean, but re- friends don't come to Name Thanksgiving. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Like you talk to him every yeah. night. And name oh. one fucking friend. <laughs> that, yeah, what the fuck? Um, well, I mean, like in person, friends I can. Be yeah, with, yeah, but yeah, I, yeah. It's like a selfish but, thing when I was a kid. I'm like, man, I wish my family was smaller. That because like I've always wanted to move, but it's like every time I bring up moving, they're like, you, you don't want to be with us, like yeah. here. But it's also like, Dude, you know, it, I like having a big family, you know. But I, yeah, you also like going crazy mode. Yeah. You can't do that next I to him. I know I can't yeah. go crazy mode next to him. Well, I, you know, my dad and I get down, but the rest of them, I can't mode. really get, can't go go full goblin mode. And I, I, is your mom like, uh, does she not like date or any, or like she does, she has no interest or, uh, this is weird. This is personal. No, I let, let, let me, let me. This no, guy, this is like answer. prying open a clam, yeah, so, and I love yeah, it. Look sorry. at him. This is he's so like, weird. He's I, backing up, and he's like, well, "What the hell?" Like, my, I'm like, I'm that's only weird. Weird. turned I, on I, me. I do not, I, I do not yeah. talk about my no, like private fair, life at fair. all. It's just my weird to me. My grandma, I've never liked that. When she got like cheated on by my grandpa, and like the apparently my douchebag grandpa and left. Well, she had my just my dad. And then yeah. she never is dated again. She's never, she's like completely, con- I don't know, I hope content. That's how she seems. So she's like the sweetest woman I've ever known. But like she yeah. is just since I've ever been alive, you know, way before, you know, 20 years before I was born, like she's just always been alone in her house. But she, I, nah. she seems to like it that way. Like she just has her story. Yeah, my, my mom just, she just smokes cigarettes and plays Farmville all day. That's basically the... Fuck yeah. Facebook not gaming much, can get much, some people through some dick. shit. <laughs> my, dude, my other grandma, <laughs> when Farmville came out, oh. she was like, can I have your Facebook login? Like, she would tend to mine and my cousin's Farmville accounts and keep our, keep us up to date. Like, she would play That's for insane, us. insane, dude. And she'd probably see me in my DMs being like, can you show me your pussy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And she was just on there, like, oh fucking, fucking into my crowds. I logged in there like eight years later. I'm like, Jesus Christ, this is a good <laughs> farm. This is a really good farm. I didn't realize that oh. my, my aunt does any sort of gaming. And then is she like all of a sudden. Second gamer. Okay, you need to get like a it's mental always... image of this lady. She's like a Cruella DeVille type. Like, like very, I don't know. She's like dresses to the nines. Everything she does. She has oh, like a very God. decorated house. Very like. Like or Bohemian or something. Like, or... uh. <sighs> 70s modern okay yeah kind of like glitzy modern if that okay. makes sense like lots of She's like probably jewels doing coke so, yes yeah, so, yeah lots of tables that are like that's a coke table yeah. you need a mirror on that bad boy. mirrored tables <laughs> yeah. okay okay and uh 
uh, she all of a sudden was just like really into it's not it wasn't Farmville. It was like the Pikmin games for the GameCube, I think. No, we, weird. <laughs> and she would like play the shit out of Pikmin. And then whatever that uh, that like game is that you, you build like a town and then there's like the traders and stuff. And I don't know, like any any game where you're like the leader of a little like, Clash of Clans. No, it's not Clash oh. of Clans. Uh. It's like it's a guess. Uh, I know it's a game uh, you've played, Brian. There's that little Tom guy that Talking Tom, the cat game. <laughs> what I played that? What the fuck are you talking about? No, it, it's it, people go like, come to my island, and they invite other people oh, over. Oh, Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing. Animal yeah. Cross. Your your aunt animal plays people. Animal Crossing. Yeah, but you need a console for that. That's like yeah, no. Real she shit. apparently she she just gets into weird shit. Or did she play it on the phone? There's like a phone one. Nah, no. Nah, well, she, well, she's playing Pikmin. She's probably playing them on the same. That bitch thing. got a Nintendo. What the yeah. fuck? Yeah. And Pikmin. Oh my god. That's cool. She's but a gamer. She's like she's she's this lady that just. I I know I've talked about this before, but <laughs> well, God, I don't know if I should. Say, I think she's retired now. She We're getting has, a little into our yeah, personals. She uh, just lied on her resume for like forty years. Like if she ever wanted to get into a different little area she would just like make up shit she'd be like yeah i know i tear down a fucking engine put it back together too yeah. well, <laughs> like yeah. don't test me on this stuff it's a waste of my time and talents and they don't uh, check they don't fucking yeah, she would go get like little certifications and stuff and then she would just be like yeah i'm like a like an aviation like engine salesman or something yeah probably <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah probably a little bit of that. that's the real qualification yeah. 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 No, she would sell like Here's medical utensils to, <laughs> yeah. to hospitals she did like she worked in like some tech companies. I don't know. She just did a little bit of everything. Like it was always just like a weird ass job. I remember my brother started driving and he was like really into his Ford. Like that's some guys that's like their identity is like they get a car and they're like, my identity is my car. He was one of those people. And my aunt had just gotten a job at a dealership just being like a Ford salesman, but she yeah. had like done the work to like, she's like a Don Draper. She did the she's work like to like Jackie of all trades. Yeah. Yeah. But she was yeah. good at it because she said, sat there and like listed off like every engine possibility for that model car, which wasn't Jesus a new car Christ. in the dealership. Yeah. Like this was like that she had cool. only been working in the dealership. Yeah. Like yeah. She did some studying. Well equipped when she yeah. Did. yeah. Yeah. She's an That's interesting cool. lady, but it's like a, Female she, James did Bond. She, did she die? <laughs> yeah. No, she's still she alive. Dead now? No, she's dead oh, no. You need to get in her. Hey, she plays her shit. Animal you need, so you, does she have kids? How many? <laughs> uh, she does not have kids. Oh, yeah. that's who you need to be talking to. She yeah, no. and get some of that those cool tables. Oh, no, she has true. a bunch. Yeah, she, she has went... all my grandma's stuff when my grandma passed, and my grandma. Uh, oh wait, you've she, mentioned yeah, her before. She was then yeah, wealthy for like. A very short amount of time, like super wealthy. Woo, I had big. Yeah. yeah, and then uh, my grandfather, who I never met, uh, he lost it all scratch. to like a Nigerian prince scam oh, or something. Yeah, okay. Oh <laughs> my god, all of it, all of it, dude. That's so fucking. I um, would be fucking furious. Yeah, no, so, how do you? Well, okay, well, how do you go from rich to broke from one scam? Well, how? how he like how gave it all. It? He like gave it all, dude. dude. One of my. My like is all gone. Oh it was like a, a full ass fortune. And so, m point is, before you carry on, poop. Uh, yeah, sorry. All that furniture was like that was when they had all their money, and they went out and just furnished an entire house. Because when they yeah, moved from stuff. Rhode Island to Toledo, I think yeah. they were just Probably like buy property. Like, oh, we'll just burn buy all the old property. stuff, and then we'll just buy new when we get there. Like that was their version <laughs> of moving. Good like get the money. photo yeah. albums, yeah. And they they moved out there, and they bought. All their furniture was from 1973 from a, a catalog, like some company called like something, it was like Bermuda Triangle something furniture. Because I was like looking at the bottom of it. now. And I looked up the catalog and every piece that was in there was the shit that they had in this house. Yeah. It was like That's all the fight Fucking consumerism right there. <laughs> yeah. God damn. And, uh, and so it's just been passed down, dude. The stuff looks brand new. Like they took great care of it. One of yeah. my... Uh... Fucking, Speaking of like squandered wealth, I don't. Uh, I probably talked about this. Jesus Christ! I probably. I don't. I should stop prefacing things with that because I probably have, yeah. and I probably will again. Eat Get it. over it. Yeah, uh, yeah eat that shit. Eat it. Listen, same same stories and different scrambles. Listens to every podcast. It's a story casserole. 
All right, we should have three guys worth of stories, but Brian knows yeah. one person and he doesn't want to talk That's about true. her. Tell us about your mom, <laughs> God damn it. Tell Do us I, your story. Why, yeah, yeah, Tell us your my bank get, get a weird, yeah. wacky story from your mom. She has to have had um, one genuine life experience. Uh, Bri Brian's. I got, she got fucked once. You're you're here. Yeah, that's I am. Yeah, that is true. Okay, okay next podcast. Okay. I, I'm just We'll probably have a guest. I'm just going to stop mid-podcast be like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you asked it. your mom, how's his dick game? What, what, what did she do? What was your dad's dick uh, game like? Tell was me when. good? Yeah. It was free. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, tell yeah. me when. That can't and, be uh, possible. I guess. And over. stop right there. Yeah, yeah no, and then we'll stop no. right there because that's the only uh, thing I want to know. Because uh, okay. I'm assuming the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. So whatever her answer is, is how you would perform. And yeah, that's something I'm also interested in because you're real hush-hush okay. about that too. You but, don't talk to, I, I well, talk to his girlfriend talks all about the time who, about it. Who, yeah. who talks about <laughs> that shit? Everything. Oh, me, all the time. I always talk about yeah, my story. Talk about, I talk about, I I about ever coming. mention like, a girl story, I'm like, this is weird. It's not yeah. really that group. Also, my IRL friend group, we're not really like that. Nah. You know, it's like... There's one guy in it that'll be like, dude, I was like banging the fuck out of this chick. And we're like, oh, God. It's just weird, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, like, so, I'm um, all for being vulgar, but there's modest. a difference between being vulgar and and like yeah. having it and expressly joking. tied to someone. Yeah. You know, like I can yeah. be like abstractly yeah. vulgar all day. Yeah. That, yeah. But once you no, apply it to like somebody, I'm not going to be talking about me doing shit to I'll Abby. talk about like my yeah, pussy weird, being wet. Right? And I'm like, yeah. ha And then some of my friends yeah. like, yeah, I was like, Fucking her the shit out of her. I'm like, oh god. Yeah. And her pussy was wet. You make like, whoa. whoa. Yeah. And it's nothing yeah. secret. Yeah. Human being. Yeah. Dude. Yeah. That's somebody's mother. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but in the in the spirit of squandered wealth, one of my best friends who fucks like a rabbit, dude. Let me tell you what. Uh he's got like a very because we all like a lot of my IRL group, you know, we're all from the same town. We all had, like, kind of similar raisings. This guy's got, like, the worst ever. Like, both of his parents are, like, semi, like, for their time, like, famous, I guess. Or, like, they were wealthy. Like, they had money for a while. Yeah. Uh, like, they both independently, like, it starts to get a little doxing. But, like, one was. Is this a, the know. one that was, like, like musician? Yeah, yeah. Okay. His dad is, like, in a, oh. in a famous band kind yeah. of deal. And his mom's like the Beatles. Might yeah. have heard of them. John Lennon. <laughs> and his mom is like on the cover of magazines and shit. Yeah. And uh, oh, shit. they are they were fucking poorer what? than my family growing up somehow. What the fuck? Because they just like squandered it so poorly and they're so dumb with their money. And Wait. there there's even like they had a they had like a a fucking penthouse in New York City that they sold and my mom was like do not sell that do not sell that and they sold it to build a recording studio in our town that was never this is what they're gonna friends gonna listen to this and be like man <laughs> airing out my dirty laundry <laughs> but like uh. and then there was no music ever made there and it was all a a huge waste and then like i mean they still have avenue like they have like weird connections to rich people still so every once in a while like a rich person will be like here's money but they're just like i don't know it's like we used to talk about it when we were kids and be like damn that'd be a lot cooler if you guys had some fucking money laying around or like you yeah, know, yeah. could take us somewhere cool or something yeah. like gee like we would just see the remnants of like all these fucking like awards and shit we're like you think you could scrap that sell that <laughs> yeah. fucking... yeah. they, their fridge most barren fridge in the world they have a notorious onion drawer Big fish, small pond, I think is a big <laughs> mentality with them. Yeah. And, uh, but yeah, it was always like, yeah, get fucked, dude. Like, what the hell? Like, where's all your money, man? Where's your money? You know, we'd only wanted to hang out with them for his money and he never had me. Uh, and like, that uh, suck. Yeah, it yeah, does. Yeah. I, somimes I just stop talking to people when they're like that. I, I had a what, weird. Did I have money? No yeah. money. <laughs> yeah, no yeah. money. Yeah. Sorry, bye. <laughs> if, they, yeah, oh. if they don't have enough followers or something, <laughs> yep. their credit card declines. Yeah. Right? Call me back yep. after payday, I'm... dumbass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I fucking don't talk to them. Let me see your social blade. How many? What's? <laughs> are you gaining or losing followers? Yeah. Where are you? Which way are you heading? <laughs> oh, this is a sinking <laughs> ship. And then... I. What. I was going to say, Whoa. just to probably dumb <laughs> one off of, like, I definitely, like, my friend, even though he's always like, oh, we need money, like, blah, 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 like, oh, we're hungry. 
like I had such a weird juxtaposition of early childhood because I've mentioned before, like my mom dated a rich guy. Yeah. And it's like I would go over there and hang out and it's like, yeah, let's go skiing. And then I'd like <laughs> go go to my dad's or like they'd break up and it's like I just got tossed all around. And I think that's why I mentioned it like what? So it's like beer budget with champagne taste. Like I got a little taste for oddities and the finer things in life. In your developing years. Yeah, man. in my developing years. And then it all kind of got yeah. taken away. And I was like, what the fuck? And then it was all, and now like my mom's actually doing pretty well. So like my little sister and everyone, they're set. They're fine, probably. I mean, I think if you looked into actual debt versus, you know, I think there's probably a lot of credit card debt going into there. Sorry, oh, mom. You know, <laughs> don't die until you pay that shit off. <laughs> yeah. Please. Um, but yeah, it was like a, it's like a weird tossing around of it, but now it's like, I got to be better for my kids. I got to be more stable. I don't think I'm going to have kids anymore, though. When I think about it. <laughs> Why? You get one of those 40 year mortgage now. Because now. day is going to be yeah. mandatory in Indiana any moment. <laughs> I also gonna... saw in Indiana any uh, public librarians that are caught providing books, like, in other words, having the books on bookshelves that are harmful to minors. Doing their job. Could be, yeah. What's a harmful to minor book, though? Uh, well, that's based, Harry that's Potter? judged yeah. based off of a well, committee, 1984. I guess. Uh, they, they figure it out. Uh, and they tell you what's Indiana's, okay. But I think it's a felony if they're caught. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah tough to be a librarian. Was there. Yeah, all those people, all those aspiring librarians are probably going to yeah. have a career switch, and we're going to be all out of librarians. Just because they didn't want to go to jail. It hasn't been yeah. cool to be a librarian since the internet was invented, though. So it's basically, like, yeah. I don't it's, even you're, know you've what basically been turned into the person that shoes the homeless people that are masturbating yeah. at the public computer. <laughs> yeah. You're just a broom shoer. You're like Get a, back. You're Put like that a thing quiet away. social worker or something. <laughs> yeah. uh, I yeah, don't you know. Go, Y2K really ruined a <laughs> yeah, library. There's a lot of that. I haven't, God, yeah, I haven't been to a library in a while. <laughs> dude, you have a library cards, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, honestly, well, libraries like, are dope because privilege thing. they have like printing and stuff you can do for dirt cheap. Yeah, if you need to like you make a bunch of copies, they're cheap. I mean, at home you have it's to go so buy a printer and oh, you have to they get got, the yeah, they got the, the but they also got the mega printers. Yeah, they got too, those like that the just like office <laughs> ones. <laughs> like yeah. if you're shooting, if you want to like, do like a bunch of shit. yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah. kids missing or whatever. My kids local yeah, library awesome like used to have like movie night every once in a while, and they had like Star Wars comic books that were like actually good. And I had some good times in my local. It was shitty little library, but really like they they did a they did a decent job for our town. Like they really. They cared. Yeah. And I stole every I Spy book out of that place and never returned them. And my parents got hit with a fat check. But oh my. Fat, like, a check? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They paid us. Thanks for taking those off our ends. Dude, my I like, Spy is fucking fuck rock. Is I Spy? Yeah, like, why yeah. do you owe, like, yeah, what? You owe, like, $50 to the library? I'm like, oh. oh my. I Spy's were my favorite, dude. I love. I have, so I have cool. all of them. I have, I still have them. They have my oh. name in them, and I now my I got them back from my That's mom. Sweet, and uh, me and my kids That's do. Them, me and Madeline do. I think those I things are awesome. And the guy that does those, I don't know his name. Fucking he, he's Harvey fucking, Weinstein. No, that guy's yeah. a fucking yeah. genius. Oh yeah, how's he a genius? Have you seen the? They're all like actually just photos, yeah, like cool sets and yeah. little miniatures, and so they're yeah. badass. They yeah, really so, are. And some of them have like little, uh, like it'll be something, and then the shadow it lays down is something else. You know, I want to see those books again. They're awesome. Live. There's some really good ones. I haven't seen one in twenty years. Uh, there's some they're fucking hard so. that I have to cheat for because I'm uh, like, it's you like cheat. What are you well, like? Because I try to put answers? my kid to bed at eight, and it's like we're trying to find this guy, these four jacks or something on this page. Before these edibles kick in, and, like, and, and I'm sitting there get... just like, dude, it's like four thirty. <laughs> like it, we've been thirty minutes on this, and she won't close the fucking book until the last jack is found. And so I'll uh, just be on my phone like this book. Mystery. Okay, it's the mystery one. Uh, page twenty seven yeah. answers, and there'll be like little oh. circles. Uh, to That's solve it, I don't <laughs> yeah. remember them being. So, yeah, some of them are fucking hard. hard. Okay, get yeah, the I ultimate know. puzzler edition. All right, Ulti okay. well, ultimate well, puzzler well, you're edition. Not, you're not an ultimate puzzler. puzzler. That's, Show your kid what? like a basic one. They have the yeah. okay. The basic ones are too easy though. They there's oh. no middle ground. This guy's there's just no it's either you. it's either the ultimate hardest puzzler. shit in the world or the Master easiest. Masterclass in in where's Waldoing or. Since Brian doesn't want to fucking talk about his goddamn mom, yeah, you sit over what? there and solve your master puzzler I was, no, eyes. I was, looking, I was trying to look I saw it that up. screen on, light master. up. He was gonna be like, "How <laughs> ultimate are these no, no, puzzles?" No. I, I, you said, "Look it up." I want to see how complicated it they're, is. They're I can't find it. They're shit everywhere. This guy just 
it's basically just like a photo of Poob's room, and they're like, find the thumbtack. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, ah, freaking everywhere. I, I Someone buy. told me that in my right. in my channel once. They're like, "You your room looks like an I Spy page." I'm like, "That is so fucking nice of you to say, dude. That is awesome. It That's is really badass. It is it, yeah, it's That's like cool. insanely maximalist." And now that I got my display yeah, yeah, case shit. coming in, my Oblivion display case. Well, you got that? What the fuck? Where is that gonna go? That thing looks no like idea. it's meant for two things, and that's like, yeah, displaying Towards stuff from Oblivion. In, yeah. in your house, or yeah, a Calvary saber should be yeah. laid up I in it. I have a Calvary saber, dude. I'll <laughs> really? throw that shit in there. Yeah, like, it's yeah. upstairs. You Some would coins. You gotta come over sometime and see the actual. The upstairs decorated much more professionally. Much, oh, yeah. uh, it's less packed in, but still, there's oddities, you know, everywhere. Yeah, really love it. Really love it. Moving nightmare. Nightmare freaks me <laughs> out all the time when I think about it. Yeah, dude. They. I don't yeah, know. I'm dug in. Yeah. I am stuck. I, I, don't I know. thought I, I was know. dug in at my last place, and then, and then we were like, we need to fucking move. And yeah. how was the it? horror of moving everything over here? Oh, it was agonizing. It was absolutely just crippling having to I like. Move, pull well, the, no one likes moving, but yeah, yeah if, if, especially if you got yeah. kids and shit like that, probably sucks. And, and we shipped them off. Oh, yeah, yeah. they're gone. I bet. Well, yeah, did your brother help years. you move since he was moving in? No, he oh, a lot a of that. Yeah, he, 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 came, he came over and like helped me for like it was like two big things. I was like, "Can you do?" By the way, I've I've seen a discussion mm. about this on Twitter. The differences between when someone says, "Hey, can you help me move?" and and they say yes, respect that person's time a lot more than you would like. Some people just go like, "Oh, okay, that means you're coming over here and helping me packing shit up in boxes." Oh and stuff. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. You have all that covered. Everything's yeah. the, it's in boxes. Yeah, yeah. And the boxes are already things, in the truck. Packing. You're there for like two person things. So me and Abby well, moved everything into the house, and then I called my brother and I was like, "Help me get this fucking drill press into the garage. Help me get like all the two people things, like big dressers and stuff." Because Abby broke a rib last time we were moving stuff. Oh, and Jesus Christ. I fucking pushed her. Yeah, yeah. She, <laughs> she was not. Uh, no, she, I, I had her moving into. Respecting my time. <laughs> yeah, to say the least. Yeah. <laughs> she, lit, she lit the furniture leg, touched the floor outside. Pack a box. Uh, yeah. Dang it. <laughs> what push? Yeah. It cracked her one. No, she was uh, were shipped away. She Just was super out. sick, and we were trying to move into oh. our first like like rental place. We were moving into. <laughs> I don't care to. if you're sick. And she yeah. was coughing, and every time she would cough, it like apparently you can you can crack a rib coughing. I didn't know that. How so frail, how frail is, is she? Is. Well, no, what it was like an old timey woman. If she's <laughs> what it was, yeah, was we him. were picking up a big ass couch, and she <laughs> squatted, picked it up, and then coughed as she was standing uh, holding the couch, and it just fucking it, like. <laughs> And she was like, ah, a little fucking <laughs> dude. And, and I was like, I was like, oh my God, are you all right? And she's like, yeah, I think I'm all right. But man, my side really hurts. I go, it might rain. <laughs> like we have to get the couch yeah. inside. Oh. And so I made her, she's so pissed about this, but I made her finish. Oh. Uh, I mean, like we can't leave everything serious. in the fucking U-Haul. Yeah. I was yeah. like, unpack through it, bitch. You'll heal later. You know, Damn. your body heals, but the now stuff in those exactly. boxes yeah. doesn't. This, yeah. That's ruined forever. Used yeah. weird. <laughs> yeah. It's, yeah it's used off. And, <laughs> she walks like a jockey from that is so, Left 4 Dead. Yeah. That is such an, that's one of the more embarrassing ways I've ever heard of someone break something. Yeah, what the fuck? Coughing? I, yeah, coughing. I, I Dude, think I herniated a disc picking up my child. Well, out of a crib. Mm, that's <laughs> also embarrassing. Yeah, a baby? A really I picked up tiny. a baby? Yeah. yeah. A baby. Dude, I bet that was, pre, that was more before than you got babies, that, was, that was before you got jacked, though. That was before you started hitting the gym. Yeah, before. Dude, Dude, yeah speaking now of, you, my roommate just ordered and it got here squat rack, Damn. Oh, shit. Olympic bench press bar, like the forty-five <laughs> pound ones with weights. Yeah, and a little cable machine. So fuck yeah, Can we yeah see that in your room? Be, and I'm already on that Bowflex bike, so. Get on it, it's man. a new it's a summer of activity and moving a little each day nice. <laughs> oh, <laughs> i challenge you guys to move at least a little every day yeah every viewer out there oh man um, i look at all those like gym motivation yeah, videos where I like like people go to do a squat and then they end up shitting their intestines out because of all the pressure 
I'll never work that oh, hard. Oh, God. What? Yeah, what <laughs> the like, fuck? Yeah, that's hurt insanity. Like, <laughs> I'm not going to like push past the, my max the moment, ever. The moment <laughs> I'm uncomfortable yeah. for a second, I'm dropping yeah, it. I'm yeah. done. <laughs> Fuck no, he was doing, he was doing like an myself. Olympic weightlifting, <laughs> yeah. like, and he, 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 he like goes down and for like the Olympic squats, <sighs> you, you don't just go to like a 90 degree angle on your knee. Like you, you drop your ass almost you to back. the floor. <laughs> yeah. And when he drops it down to the floor, I, I guess the pressure was too much and it <laughs> shoots his intestines out of his <sighs> asshole. I, I saw a video Jesus earlier, Christ. like it was right before I went to go Can work out. Practice? This guy was just doing a bench press and his fucking arm snaps. Uh, I'm like, oh, oh no! Yeah, oh. Like that. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That's why. I, that's Jesus. not why I don't like working out, but it doesn't help thinking about stuff like that or seeing it. Yeah, yeah. It's a little bit frightening, and you know, I would like to think that I've got pretty hardy bones, and I wouldn't snap like that. But you never know. You never know, man. My uh, like would. my grandma's old neighbor, like, dude, was actually. I remember the age because this happened a long time ago when I was younger. Because I remember seeing this guy who I thought was just a regular age dude. He was 34 at the time. 34. So, God, like, yeah. right close to my age. And Scary. He, I saw him, like, in his driveway with one of those, like, uh, the walkers. And he was, like, using a walker to go check <laughs> the mail. And I, like, went over there. I was like, what the fuck? You're, like, 34. Why are you, yeah. why are you w in a walker? And he's like, apparently I have some sort of, like... <laughs> Yeah, he's got like <laughs> <laughs> way too hard. Three a month. <laughs> It'll kill you. <laughs> Don't do it wrong. <laughs> And I forgot about it, and now and it's you yeah. You're bringing it back. I'd rather be broadcasting. Podcasting. Yeah, that's an awesome <laughs> shirt. Oh yeah. Hey, man. What the fuck? Uh, I've uh, been waiting to slip that in organically. Yeah. I just had to cut your story in half and <laughs> yeah. ruin that real quick. Okay, uh, what are you saying? This guy? Oh was... yeah, no. He, apparently, he has some like Ew. bone density oh. disease, and his like oh, his pelvis turned into like uh, chalk, Ouch. basically. And so he just had a Mister Glass moment where he's like, "I was having Ew. hip pain," and then like he fell or something, or uh. like fell backwards or sat <laughs> down on something hard. <laughs> his fucking pelvis. Just disintegrated, oh, and so fuck. and so he had to like go get like new pelvis surgery or something. But How they did just he cut into you. With, yeah, with the, yeah. Everywhere what did they do? They cut you in half and then put it back on. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. I think they went in there and just like they poured like molten lead on it, and they're like, hopefully it turns out like pelvis concrete. shaped. Yeah. Yeah. When your whole pelvis disintegrates, does it just like go down to the bottom of your feet or what? Like it just, yeah. Like, it yeah, they, it oozes sand, down you. The sand, like chunky uh, pieces of sand. No, I think oh, he just fuck. had like a oh. multi insanely insane fracture that just went all the way through his pelvis. Do you just get held by like hooks in the air at that point or what like how do you sit? Yeah. Your pelvis breaks. Oh, the horrible thing is is when he was in his walker, he was like, Yeah, I've just like been in my house. Like this happened months ago. Oh. oh, like so it took him months to just be able to like Dude, so get up it, just to like get that, the walker like status. Anything I could complain about, and I like to complain, it's like yeah. It's not that bad. It's really not yeah. that bad ever. I used I to have a like a month ago. I used to have like the, not a month ago. It was probably a year ago. I used to have this like mantra or like thing I do where I'd sit back and I'd be like, "You need to appreciate how good you have it." I don't like to appreciate, but you know, <laughs> I, but I like to lame. realize I need to complain yeah. less. Yeah. But I don't. Appreciation's different. Uh, I I would sit back and be like, "You need to acknowledge that these is the good times." You yeah. know. There's bad times in the future. You need to just be at ease with the the fact that and acknowledge the and fact that everything's gonna be bad. Yeah, yeah. Everything's going worse. awesome right yeah. now. And then it, yeah. I immediately forget it, and I'm just like, "Fucking kids, shut <laughs> up! You're so yeah. fucking loud." Check yeah, my know. blood pressure, one sixty five. Oh, yeah. these kids are killing me. <laughs> Fuck. I have the hardest life in the world. Yeah. yeah. Oh, sometimes hell. I wake up from my job that I can do at any time, and I'm tired. I'm very tired. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, and I have to go to the mantra yeah. again. I got to oh, this is uh, some people can't do yeah. this. Some people don't it's wake people up without clean water. <laughs> yeah. Some people go to sleep forever. Some, yeah. Some people fucking suck. Yeah. No. Oh, yeah. But, we got it pretty good. Uh, Little do I know, right now I have a cancer festering inside of me or something in the, mm. the dark oh, times. You can't think about that. Yeah, you can't true. think about the evil little cancer cell that's building right now. Er yeah. Eradicate it, forming. Uh, Little oh, do I know God. I'm about to do a second growth spurt, which will also increase the size <laughs> of my penis and balls. That would be crazy. Uh, 
<laughs> do you think you think one of us is gonna get taken out by cancer? Do you think it Probably, is? Probably. Statistically, wise, sadly, yeah. maybe. Yeah. Statistically, I'm going to go. I'm gonna die unceremoniously from an accident. You're gonna get cancer. No, Ryan, it's you're just saying my yourself. ticker, okay. my suicide, ticker yeah, right suicide. here is gonna take me out. Yeah, yeah, you're you're gonna have heart what? failure, I'll have liver failure. And... I'm gonna drive off a cliff. Yeah, Brian, Brian's, yeah. Gonna, Brian's gonna, Brian's gonna, gonna lose his driving. mom, and then realize drive off a, drive he's off never shared Falls. enough personal information to get close to anybody else in his oh, life. No, no, his he's mom gonna kill is gonna get really old and be like, "I'm taking you with me, baby," and she's gonna drive off a cliff. She's stabbing. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to break up a fight in a diner and get stabbed in the throat like that kid. How the, come you get a noble way? Well, it's not gonna be that cool. It'll be from behind. Like, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, 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 wasn't cool. the it wasn't even a cool fight either. Yeah, he's gonna just, cut my entire uh, head off and hold me up by the hair. <laughs> and just throw it at the oh, counter. Got him up. <laughs> this guy wasn't even a part of this. <laughs> yeah. Mind your own business. <laughs> Warning, dude. That dude. That's the worst to be the example for a bad guy. That's the fucking worst. You're gonna death. have an oh. open body cat or open <laughs> casket where I'm either just the body and no head or just the head. No body. But you know how there's like the two doors. There's the one for like the body and the yeah. head. And, like, what yeah. if you get beheaded? So they just leave the little door closed. Yeah. Yeah. Free, so yeah. All you see is <laughs> neck the body. <laughs> yeah. Just neck down. Yeah. Yeah. to the face. Best features anyway yeah. and they put my pull my penis out of my pants and look, yeah. draw a little face on it <laughs> so all the ladies uh, can kiss yeah. him on the forehead <laughs> I, uh, I have I've joked about that before, like with <laughs> even my family. They're like, "Don't talk about that." Don't talk about that. I'm like, "I want I don't want my funeral to be that somber." If like you know, my parents have to bury me, like loosen up a little bit, or like like prop me, like <laughs> over stuff it. me or something. Like but that's stuff easy me into... to say for somebody that isn't experiencing yeah. the loss of death. Yeah, well, you just no, get to selfish, fucking fly off selfish, into oblivion. Yeah, yeah I yeah. get to go to eternal sunshine in the sky. You know, I'm going to see my master, um, my creator. You guys, chill out. Come on, keep it together for the rest of the family. But, you know, I'm going to keep that energy when my parents die. I'm going to stuff them and <laughs> say, this is what they want. They want yeah. it to be fun. Come on, guys. I'm going to be the alcoholic ruining the funeral. Come on, yeah. get up. Mom would have loved this. <laughs> pour some pour some forty in her mouth. Or something. Yeah. <laughs> Take her on one last ride oh, on your motorcycle. Come on, yeah. come on, mom! Come you can do ride on the hog. <laughs> Flies off the first ramp. Man, we <laughs> talked about this. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> My mama, she gone. Is it? Yeah. Who is this? Like Dominicans or something like that? That that like propping up the person at the them. funeral. That's like so a badass. common thing. That, yeah, that, yeah, like, that's they, like one guy, yeah. like the guy, he likes playing piano, the so they'll put him on a Xbox keyboard one, or something. Where it's like yeah. he's playing yeah. Xbox. That'd be sweet. I want me on Mine a piano, even though off. I've never played uh, before. I'd be jerking off in a room that looks like this one, and it's like a, and just sitting on a bed. And, and they replace and I, I your wall look happy. with a glass window, and people can just walk yeah. by and see you. Exactly. I want to be in a museum with yeah. all my shit. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. This is how we live. Dude, like a like a red square, you know, yeah. like they did linen, you know. I I look in there, know it's what like you're, you're talking about. You're but. still alive. Oh, they they embalm oh. linen, and it's like oh. some big secret, yeah. though. The, it's a the secret. Form, it's a big secret of well, you okay, know, okay. Oh, the embalming secret. Yeah, the, the embalming secret. Because Lennon died, and they're like, we'll put him in the red square or whatever. And they will embalm him. And it's like some What's ongoing. What's the red square? It's like a big square, like a big like meeting big place. One. like a Think city planning, like a square, a town square. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. And, and he's, it's red. And he's yeah, he's there, and he's like, you can go view John Lennon, not John Lennon. Fuck, let him <laughs> John Lennon. I, mean, what? Lennon. Oh, I thought you were talking about John Lennon this whole time. Like, no, no, Lennon, no, no, the other Lennon, no, 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 John, John Lennon. Lennon of the, the other Lennon, no, Vladimir Lennon, the Russian bomb. Lennon, red yeah. square, With gunshot wound or something. Like, no. What are you talking about? He, he, he gets <laughs> embalmed. And they put him in there, and then everybody <laughs> remarks, they're like, it's so lifelike. And then you go look at it, and it's not lifelike <laughs> at all. He looks like a Freaking fucking dead guy. Job. He looks like, yeah. a, a, like a shitty <laughs> yeah. wax figure. Oh. And I get it. He died in oh, like, like, the Ripley's Museum like shit. 1928 Dude. or something. I don't know when he died, but yeah. I just thought about I get you. it. It's pretty good, but not Like great. shrunken heads? Yeah. Could they, sh could they do a shrunken body? Could I just become <laughs> yeah. like a little doll? A little guy? Like yeah. I, I don't see why not. Yeah. 
Put it like pickle work. me or something, and you just have a little shrunken like voodoo doll of me. A little mini poo. Yeah. And then people can pass or bring it to this event. Bring it to this event. You can like uncle at Bernie's to me without having to carry around like a full dude. Uncle at Bernie's, I just said. Yeah. <laughs> weekend at Bernie's. My uncle Vinny at Weekend at Bernie's. Like you can just carry me around, but I'm like, a, like I'm way more. Has there ever, has there shit, ever yeah. been an actual shrunken head? I, right? Aren't those like, is that like not what? Those are fake. I think those are. Well, like how a would myth. you? How the fuck? How like would you? Head? There's like there's like bones in there. No, I think oh, they I would like deep like, like, the uh, They the actually head. they actually take their fucking it was bones like out, a, like a head bone thing or something. Yeah, their head bone comes out and their brain goof. I'm pretty sure it's like one of those like Vikings no. wear horned helms type thing. I, no, no, I just it's didn't, a like, it's a thing. It's a legit thing. I just didn't okay. think they yeah. had that kind of like technology back then, right? What to, to, rip, to rip off someone's head and debone uh, it? A whole head, yeah, and de debrain it, debone it, and then like put it's it. How primitive do you, do you think these people I it was are? It's a shrinking ray. Yeah. Yeah, no, they I don't just know. leave the I head really out in the sun. Oh yeah, it's a it's a religious significance thing in like Peru and Amazon rainforest. It's only been documented in the northwestern region of the Amazon rainforest. That's awesome. What the? Eight disturbing facts about real Says shrunken head, heads. Head hunting has occurred in many regions of the world, but the practice of head shrinking has only been documented in the northwestern region. Amazon forest. That's cool, dude. No, that's what I'm saying. Like, uh, all right, well, yeah, get a shrunken body. Yeah, just do shrunk, what they shrink do. my whole body. Just take all my shit out except for a little bit of skin. For, yeah, make little me little guy, a little, get him a little leave suit. His penis dude, bone if so I could look like out. this, yeah, if they so could make my head, head look like this, <laughs> and my body look like the rest of what Why this does would it look like? Looks, no, the yeah, whole point of a shrunken horrified. head is that it looks shrunken and dry. No, that looks so wet and moist. Well, I'd prefer to have a little moisture left in me. That one looks yeah, so supple. Shrunken what the hell is that this is a real shrunken head. <laughs> oh, yeah. I bought this at an <laughs> antique store. It was yeah, still baby boxed, dives. and it's like a toy they used to sell. It's called like, it's got like a little asshole on it. Is it pantyhose? <laughs> yeah, that looks. Like, yeah, that's a it's a pantyhose with like well. cotton knit balls in it, and yeah. a little face. Hey, I'm poop. Uh, my mom and practice. my brother <laughs> used to make, uh, or they they made Pantyos. one time pantyhose. No, yeah. pantyhose pigs. Same process, oh. looked the same, oh. but it was like a little piggy, and they had oh. little legs and everything. And I remember when my brother was in his angstiest, most gothic phase, he got super mad at mom. No. And he was oh, like, fuck. I'm going to make bacon. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and oh, he tore oh, into fuck. his piggy like a zombie tearing into a man's no. stomach. <laughs> it cleft it in twine. <laughs> And the stuffing oh. was everywhere, yeah. Mom found him eating the stuffing. I remember she was so <laughs> stuffing fucking over his shirt. hurt. Yeah, she was she was upset. That is a that's a mean thing to do to your mom. Yeah, and I was in my bedroom listening. I kind of always relished those moments where it was like them fighting and <laughs> not, I just, yeah, not I was you. just yeah. back in my room, yeah. like vibing. Yeah. And yeah. I remember that and I and I was always jealous of the fact that she had made one with him, yeah. but not me. Like yeah. mine was always yeah. like the afterthought. Like whenever she yeah. just did something with Zach, she was Aww. like, oh, "I guess I gotta do it with this little shit too." So she did it with like no heart, you know. Yeah. yeah. And uh, and I remember that fallout over that torn up piggy. It felt good. And it was like yeah. it wasn't like I, like I knew I was a bad person for liking it. Yeah. I feel like, <laughs> I was like this is it. bad person behavior. Me yeah. going like. <laughs> Good. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad this is happening. I don't know yeah. what that uh, what emotions being displayed there, or what character trait that is, yeah. but it's There's not my proudest moment. It, I didn't say yeah. I was proud of it. I'm saying I don't it happened. Think I am a hero. <laughs> no. <laughs> not in this. No, life. Was, <laughs> not in this. Not know. with pantyhose piggies. That's yeah. how I know I'm a <laughs> bad boy. <laughs> Weird. I, I never. I was more. My older brother, mom would fight. I'd be like, no. No, no. <laughs> no, I did. I, I definitely. I tried to narc a couple times. They got brought up oh. when I was in Florida. About the time where my older brother, my mom had like put baking soda down the stairs to the basement because it like smelled down there. So I, and I walked down the stairs. I was like six or seven. I was like, oh, and I went and told my mom like, oh my god, like you gotta, you gotta see this. Like dead serious. She came over there. I'm like, look. And I thought it was cocaine <laughs> all the way down yeah. the stairs. Like, I just thought it was, like, <laughs> drugs. I'm like, look what he's doing. And they're like, you little narc. Like, it's not drugs. It's goddamn cleaning stuff. 
<laughs> how your messy mom would you shit? Yeah, Who are you one. accusing? Your brothers? My older brother, yeah. yeah. How messy I, with his yeah. coke? Like, he's that rich? Like, <laughs> I knew just to, yeah, yeah, I didn't like realize that it'd be like thousands of flower girl of dousing the yeah. room with coke. Tens of thousands of dollars of cocaine <laughs> all the way down these stairs. <laughs> I want to walk uh, in this pool. I, I went up to it and I went, cocaina, <laughs> look. I grabbed it with a little bit of a knife. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's She's the real like, shit. what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> yeah. And I had that I had that like that same thing. Well, little did I know, like my brother was doing like big time drugs down there. I just caught the right, you know, yeah. I caught the yeah. wrong tracks. But my like <laughs> I was always like uh I'm like the little golden boy, you know, I'm the white sheep of the family. And my stepdad always has like been like like wanted it's like my family roots on for me to get in trouble. It's like a weird feeling. Like they all like anytime <laughs> I like I don't know. They they say it's not like this, but when they talk about it, it's very much like this where it's like You get their rocks off. Yeah, the it's golden like anytime falls, I like hit an mud achievement on or like I would be like, Oh, they're they're always like, Oh, look at him, graduating from college <laughs> with good grades. Like oh, a little suck up. And they're always like, Oh yeah, like when's he gonna mess up? Like when's it because I just never like you know, I'm more secret about that kind of stuff. I've never been like caught yeah. in trouble. And uh my little sister was like, I I had done something. I'd been like, you cannot tell, you know, mom and dad, like, do not talk about this. You know, five minutes later, she goes to their room and it's like, I got to tell you something. Like, Sam did something really bad. And my stepdad's like, what? What? Like, tell me, tell me. Like, come <laughs> here. Like, he's like, the when he retells his story, I'm like, why are you so hungry for this <laughs> yeah. information? Because yeah. he's like, what was it? Like, come on. Yeah. And she's like, okay, like, you can't tell that uh, Sammy did this. And he's like, what, what? And she's like, he killed something. And he's like, what, what? Like, come on. <laughs> yeah. And it was in Far Cry 3, I killed and skinned a goat. And I was like, don't, like, you shouldn't see this. Because, you know, you're like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, like, rim apart. And they're like, god damn it. Like, it's just like <laughs> yeah. video game fodder. Like, they're like wanting to hear that, like, I had done drugs in my you bedroom. Fucking, or yeah. So you're like, yeah, or did a hit and run. Yeah, like, like <laughs> or I, like, you know, like you broke your hand like riding a scooter drunk or yeah. something. Yeah, see, yeah I don't exactly. Know about that. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I'm a little sweetheart. I'm a little, I'm a little angel, and most of the time I am. Um, but yeah, that was when they tell that story. I'm always listening. I'm like, this doesn't really read for me like as funny because I'm like, what? Like, oh, you guys weren't just happy. I was a good kid. It's more, <laughs> more like uh, that little kiss ass or something. I'm, yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. They yeah. raised a dweeb and they're upset about it. Yeah, the, I'm yeah. It's like a tale. Uh, your child's yeah, character yeah, is a direct yeah. reflection of your parenting. You know. Yeah. And, I guess we weren't badass yeah, enough they for our house. House. They should have yeah. cranked more hogs in the yeah, living room yeah. or whatever. Whatever needs to be done to raise badasses they, like me and Brian. They, they always bring up to like. Am I Brian high school? is yeah. absolutely <laughs> cooked. He is so yeah, you both of you start. Brian was Wait, cooked was, from the first second. What? Yo, yeah, what you were cooked before you came in here. Than, what's more badass you than fire? You almost lit your dude, fucking hair on fire. I saw that shit. <laughs> I got that I got content, on at like eight forty five, and I went in yeah. there, and Brian and Swift are just. You could tell they're cooked and they're playing Minecraft yeah. and they're mining together, yeah. fretting about a, a, what layer does diamond most most well, frequently we spawn to, we at or something. To, we were trying to make a big hole in his house to, to like to the point where it's so dark you couldn't see. I don't know. You guys that was, are that's how it started. <laughs> that's how it started. Wait, Dude, what if this hole time. got that, so deep? That you yeah, couldn't, you couldn't see, see anymore. You have to dig down like yeah. 15 blocks for that in Minecraft. No, like, it's I, dark I, quick. No, he's like he's down there at like 350 or something. We were we were in the depths. We hit bedrock. Yeah. Dude, it's fucking uh, dark. Every time I've played, it's like where are my torches at? Like, <laughs> yeah. Well, weird. it's different because it's a light up uh, lit up house. Oh, so okay. It's so like, he was doing like a bathroom where you piss, but you're also standing over like a big black oh, over glass. Like, nothing I've seen you know? a bathroom yeah. like that. It's over an elevator shaft in an old building. Yeah, right. they could just it's use horrifying. like mirrors. The same shit. Yeah. That's cool. Mm. I don't want a mirror but, anywhere near where I'm peeing because then I see Yeah, like my what penis. if it cracks and breaks? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Pff. Yeah. I yeah. see my my weird balls and my shrunken and I get, penis. And I, get, I, I, wanna, I get the opposite. I, actually, I, I actually missed that. I had a, a I, mirror that was just like that. 
I used to be able to balls. get I would get like the other view of my cock. <laughs> no, one, of my, my balls. <laughs> one of my friends in his bathroom growing up, he had a huge mirror that you, when you're on the toilet you could see yourself. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Years yeah. later he's like, Yeah, dude, I used to just like look at my asshole all the time when I was like, a <laughs> yeah. kid there. I'm like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Because <laughs> like you got up, you know, just like guys yeah. talking in Discord one time. One of my friends was like, "I don't think I've ever seen my asshole." I'm like, "Well, that's weird." Yeah. But like, you should shouldn't see it all the time. But you know, you should yeah. check in on it. You know, maybe once a year. <laughs> yeah. And my friend was like, "Dude, I used to look at my asshole all the time." <laughs> Daily. Like, yeah. I, I, could, I just, draw like, it vividly. He would just bend over and look at it. I'm like, that's <laughs> weird because I peed in there a lot and I yeah. just never once was like. <laughs> Why don't I check out the old asshole in that mirror? Yeah. I remember, dude, if I had to do asshole inspection, all I had was that thin little target mirror that goes on the back of uh, your bedroom door, and there's no light next to my door, so I'm, like, in the dark uh, trying to look at my fucking <laughs> balloon knot. Like, your, and, your asshole's just unknown territory, yeah. then. Yeah. And it's, it's, like, off the ground slightly, so I can't, like... Just oh yeah, fucking, like, get on the ground and, and like, do what's it. the and what's the point? Like, why do you need to see your asshole? Well, anyways, so then so you know, cares? like you know, there's there. no poo in it. So yeah, you know yeah. it's there. No, it's there. Yeah, that's you gotta the, you clean work. it and stuff, but you have to make sure everything's well, all right. I, 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 I get yeah. If you take a really bad shit, that the ones that feel like yeah, it's I feel like I'm broken. I want to like, make sure everything's yeah, still put wanna, together. Or when you yeah, it felt like you took you gave birth out of your ass. You're like okay. There was there was one time where in like high school, it's probably high school or maybe freshman year college where. You know, my, all my friends, it's like, yo, check out this shit I took. Like, check out this, you know, it was get, we're getting <laughs> it into territory. Like, one of my friends had, like, a ball surgery, and he, like, sent oh us a God. picture of, like, posts, like, the fucking, like, the stitches in his nuts. and so It was really gross, and it was, like, almost like a one-up each other, like, grossest thing. And one day I was like, what if I took a picture of, like, me taking a shit and you could see my asshole in it. And I remember, yeah, I like, yeah. oh, I like took a Snapchat and I was like, oh, like I cannot send this. Like, like this is really far. Like this is, I like for one moment yes. I was like, do I send this to my friends? I was like, I don't show Straining this. Straining so hard, your asshole yeah. popped inside out yeah. a little bit. Oh. Yeah. Like, I was like, I don't think you're supposed you to see, see pre what that cum looks like. coming out the end yeah. of his yeah. dick. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's a fucking slime. There's a roach on the inside of the bowl. Out. It's just like yeah. the grossest picture known to man. <laughs> My hair shot up. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sweating. I'm fucking. My entire There's body like inanimate in it, objects in the shit. Like you ate like wrappers yeah. to candy bars and stuff. Yeah. It's really well lit. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I would have sent that. Yeah, I, yeah, I, 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 I was like, oh, "We're done. We're done here. There's no more." I don't know. That was your I'm one. You were trying to break break the mold. I was trying. I, to, I'm, I was I'm trying a bad to boy too, apart. ladies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is what ladies think a bad boy just, is, right? Shows his asshole really weird. Then. Fucking asshole. Yeah. We were all just weirder. They, like, just <laughs> would send each other weirder shit, or would just like find dumb stuff like that. Fun. You know, you're a kid. You're growing up. <laughs> Dude, I'm <laughs> sorry. Like yeah. An yeah. asshole yeah. shitting is a funny sure. picture yeah. now, and I'm yeah. 30. No, it, but yeah. I wouldn't send it now. I wouldn't even take it now. But back then, I was like, what? Uh, I, I That know. never occurred to me. I might take one. Post that shit on I'm Twitter trying for to, the world well, to see. The, oh, when, I, when, I, when I was talking earlier about the, like... For the snap group, you know, the balance of like my weirdness online versus like my family. It's like when I spent that whole week with my family, (laughs) Jesus Christ, (laughs) fuck me, dude. That that scared me a little bit. It scares me, dude. He's under my my fucking feet, and then he just (laughs) always starts with a howl. (laughs) But I, uh, like. You know, it's like oh, God, pistachios. A big bag of threw me off. Oh that fuck! Asshole. I got Kit Kats. Oh god, those both sound quite oh, good. I got some Kit Kats. <laughs> I have sunflower seeds right now. It's about my best snack. Not very good. Mm. <laughs> Dude, Damn. can I go get a beverage? Like my mouth is yeah, dry, yeah, yeah. and this salty pistachio why, is doing nothing. Why is nothing. your mouth so dry? Okay. I don't know. I'm breaking I, feel it. Like, don't I break know it feels bank. when I when I when I just talk. Doesn't feel good, does it? No, not at all. <laughs> I have to get it out though, or I'll forget it. I'll forget it within seconds. I still do that. We're like, I'll have something I want to add on. And I'll be like waiting for you guys, and I'll be like pinching my finger. Like, yeah, remember, it's like the, remember. It's, you're the station's leaving. You know, you're like, <laughs> yeah. I I don't my have opportunity. much time. Yeah. with the thought before <laughs> it passes, because then you guys will say something. It's like I'm so reactive to hearing something. I'm like, oh, I gotta. I have to. I have something like that. 
personally, I think interruptions are way better than um because it shows like a like you're super engaged in a conversation. Yeah. That's not that much of an insult to me. That just means that you're enjoying what we're talking about. This is the opposite that happens with Abby and shit all the time where like I'll be talking to her about something I'm like super interested about and her eyes like glaze over. Oh god. And then she'll just like look at her phone and just like That's that's rough. Yeah, she's like super ADD and she'll just like just turn around and just like as if I'm not talking anymore and yeah. her mom does it to me too like, and I'm just like Jesus oh. fucking Christ. Yeah. So like Arsers. I've stopped even saying like sentences and shit around them. I'm just like <laughs> one word responses basically. Just like, yeah, whatever. That's that's really bad. Yeah, it sucks, <laughs> stop, dude. Stop, stop saying sentences to my wife. Yeah. What the fuck? I speak to her in grunts only. I'm just like, uh, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she just has no interest in, like, uh, like uh <laughs> your interests <laughs> yeah like yeah. anything <laughs> like anything about me or my life or you have interest in like, like stuff <laughs> you know like no no if i said something like practical in her in her life like she can be super interested about it like like you know if we plan on ripping the gross like puke stained carpet that goes up and down our stairs like oh what do you think we should do with the staircase she'll just sit there and like wig out on that and like look up all these alternate like staircases we could have or whatever yeah. staircase designs and stuff like she's really into doing like stuff around the house <laughs> or like planning mm. like how to have like gardens and stuff outside yeah. but uh makeup yeah makeup and shit like that and mm -hmm. dolls yeah. But uh, I was like, oh, my God, like Finland joined the Finland joined NATO. And she's like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what's my what's phone that? say about yeah. what's yeah, what on HDTV? <laughs> what's the word? Mm. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That hurts. We've talked about this before, too, where it's like that type of person where you're showing them a movie. And you're like, oh, I'll pause it. They're, it. they're like, don't worry, don't pause it. I'm gonna kill myself if you say that oh, to me again, yeah. dude. I will. I will. Yeah. When they get back, the type of person I am, I might turn it up more, and I'm definitely gonna pause it. <laughs> Even if they're like, don't pause it, I'm like, no worries, I'll pause it. And they get back, I'm gonna turn the volume up a little bit. Dude, well, Abby deafening. acts like there's like a time to sink into a movie. Have you ever met someone like this? Like, what do you like mean? if it's in like the first yeah, twenty minutes, she's like, "Oh, that's the like you start the movie, and then the the title that's, sequences come oh, in, and all the that. Setup, that's the, the time where I can get up, I can answer phones, I can oh, get blankets, no, I can go get no, snacks, no, pop some popcorn. No, that's when the director really starts making love to you. Oh, you can be that's setting the, the stage. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's the foreplay, baby. Yeah. What are you doing? That's when Sam Elliott's doing his whole monologue at the beginning of the Big Lebowski. You'd miss the whole preamble. Yeah, you want to come in. 20 minutes in and be unaware of the tone. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Uh, like what the hell's happening? There's a lot that can happen in those silent It's like two what minutes. gets referenced like later. There will be blood. Yeah. Like, come on. Yeah, it pisses me off. I hate shit like that. Or if like they get on their phone halfway through, it's like, what? Oh my on. god, yeah. Like, yeah. We, yeah. We you hear a TikTok video go off. Yeah. <laughs> 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 No respect for the craft. Yeah. No respect for you know how much work the went art. into the film. <laughs> yeah, I just want to like put their fucking face in the screen. Yeah, it really. Pisses the most me disrespect off. I've ever shown a film was I think watching that Neil Breen movie on Bizzle's phone being held up to oh, my yeah. eyes. Okay, well, that, that was, was like, the worst. Yeah, got that was limited screen time there, and it's like, oh fuck. Okay. <laughs> The only re the only reason that worked was because we had no power, yeah. nothing to do. And we, and like we, being were held by a movie. we were yeah. cooked. We were cooked as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, and the like, more cooked you are, the smaller the screen there. can be, and you'd be okay with it. Yeah, it'd be amazing. <laughs> Dude, I, I watched I an I entire feature link IMAX. movie on the phone yeah. speakers being held in a shaky yeah. hand. I don't think we put it on the yeah, stand. I think Bizzle did. just held it. Like it held it and was like, watch this shit. I was using my sh my little I could check yeah. it out. I was, but I was dialed in, dude. I was invested, and I had already seen the movie. I was like, "What the fuck?" I knew it was gonna be like yeah. a weird movie. This is off yeah. topic, but I also hate when you're watching something and people go, 
Oh, they must have been so high when they made this. They're like, they must have been on drugs. Well, like, how'd they come up with this stuff? You ever see, hear people like that? It's yeah. like the least interesting yeah. people you know. <laughs> the the like, people that have never taken drugs yeah, in their never life. Been high. Like, if I was high, they you know what I do? Cocaine crack. Yeah. I get scared and I eat too much. Yeah. Like, I don't fucking make art, you know? It's like, anyway. Uh, but yeah, that Neil Breen movie was really, really awful. But there were definitely funny moments. You know what I liked about it was... What? There's always that scene in like action movies where they like do the introduction of the character, and yeah. and it's like you sh- like sometimes they'll do this trope where, like if it's like some super soldier, you'll get the description of the super soldier by their like superior to someone else. Oh, yeah, and the he's person they're talking to, it's basically yeah, it's a badass motherfucker. The, That's Master Chief. Seventy five percent of that yeah. Neil Breed movie was him doing that Going to himself. Still, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've hacked I, into the Pentagon, into this NASA, into the satellite. <laughs> but that I think we were like an hour story. and 12 you minutes in, in the, and he's uh, just like... Wrap it up! <laughs> <laughs> he's yeah. like, I'm capable of hacking any satellite. It's like your ant's resume, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, he just yeah, keeps just fucking keeps going on and cancer. on. cancer. Yeah. I mm. can sell a Ford Escalade. Ever. I know the engine types. <laughs> 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 This guy's so humble. Holy fuck. <laughs> I remember, too, I had, like, five movies downloaded that I was, like, dying to show you guys. And it's like, yeah, let's, oh. let's watch this first, and maybe we'll watch something else. And we watch that movie, and everyone's like, <laughs> I think I'm ready for bed. <laughs> that was a, that was a bad it, idea. Dude, like, I, yeah. I'm such a, like, I want, like, I have so many things I just want to force people to watch. And, like, what a better opportunity to force someone to really watch something than, like, what else are you going to do? Are you going <laughs> to I actually yeah, am not, not a anywhere? fan of, of watching films with people. Really? Yeah. You like to just be full. Oh, I think we'd have well, a good time because we'd just sit there. <laughs> well, no, that, that, that's yeah. the problem is, like, yeah. like th- those hours or minutes or whatever that we spent together is, like, I could, we could, I could tell you go watch some Mario movie, and then I could go watch some Mario movie. But see, well, I guess I'm not really because, like, with my friends when we watch, like, we didn't like, do a we lot of dialogue, movie, but we do we, a lot of you know yeah. riff raft tracks or whatever riff track scene. Yeah, like, like we we make jokes, you know. We always talk through movies. Nah, I and respect shit, crack each movie. other up. I if it's well, there's nah. a, there's a movie. For the, doing that, you know, it there's depends a type on the of movie. movie. Yeah. yeah, like Neil Breen yeah, movie. Watching, yeah, you it talk doesn't through fucking it. Matter. If we're watching, right. goddamn, there will be uh, let there be blood or whatever. Uh, it's no like, country oh. for told men. Yeah, you're yeah. gonna probably shut up for ninety nine percent of the movie. <laughs> but if yeah. we're watching like some dumb shit movie, I want to show you because it's funny. I want to be like, <laughs> like, ain't that funny? Yeah. <laughs> like, and that's better with people, I think. Like, I'm, I, well, that's I'm true. definitely more of like a. I like doing shit with people, and it's like now I just sit in this couch with fucking Pip and watch movies. I'm like. Ugh, fuck, Pip, you think that was funny? And he doesn't say shit. For some reason, I feel like shows, I think because it's cable and you you turn on the yeah. TV and you sit on the couch and boom, they're there. And so naturally you talk more in that environment with like people in your living room. Sam, but TV a- shows, that's I think that's fine to talk during them. Movie, I, movies yeah, are a planned a event. Yeah. That's what, that's, yeah. Sam, yeah. I'm already thinking like if we do this fucking, you know, collage thing. Mm-hmm. I've already been like, God, it's gonna be a great opportunity to show him a couple shows that he's never Uh-oh. seen or and will Uh-oh. never watch just from me word of mouthing. Like, I really gotta be like, wow, have you heard of this new show that just came? Bang, put that on, you know. Get ready for. That. I'm gonna get you so fucking high. That's yeah, what I did to Willard. Yeah. Oh, you, dude, you yeah. forced him to watch. I think you should leave, yeah. right? Yeah, dude. The yeah. Well, that's the type of shit I do to you. That's, that's, yeah. that's the perfect thing to watch. That's, yeah. Dude, God, I. Yeah, conversation so May 30th. died down for a second, and I was just like, I don't feel like talking anymore. I'm fucking cooked. Yeah, God, and so I, I, just, I was like, have you seen this? He turned it off. Oh. Yeah. I feel so bad yeah. for Omid when I first met him, first online person I've ever met. I'm just fucking blasted, and he comes to the door. I'm like, yeah. what's up, man? Come on in. Like, you want a beer? You want to smoke? He's like, I just got out of the hospital. I can't do any of that. I'm like, oh, come on. And uh, my roommates and I were just watching yeah. Sunday in Philadelphia, and I was just, I just... And back then, like, you know, I like being social, but I have a very particular chair in my house and more so in my college apartment where my mom's like, you do was not. Was it just isolated from everybody was, else? The, the couch yeah. was behind me and I was like over here. So I would sit with my little side table and I yeah. am the closest to the TV. Yeah. <laughs> I just be like, she like, sit back there and I just sit and, uh, 
Uh, and like, <laughs> I'd have to turn, just looking I'd have at to the back around. of your head, yeah, watching yeah, you. Yeah. <laughs> just watching you go. <laughs> <laughs> fucking crack up laughing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and he didn't uh, smoke or anything. Not none of his friends did. So he was just stone yeah. cold sober yeah. watching I, you. We, yeah. not, <laughs> we didn't talk at all. I was just like, this is a good episode. Uh, I was just like one of my cracking up, oh, and they were all just sitting God. back there, like talking to each other. <laughs> yeah. And like I had to like turn around, and be like, "You guys okay?" <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. I go back to sitting. And I, uh, back. Dude, that chair ended up being a curse because, like, we'd have people over and they're all mm. sitting on the couch having fun. And I'm like, <laughs> oh, like, I want to have fun, but it would be so out of character for me to not sit in my chair because I didn't let anyone else sit in it. So it would be like, <laughs> Oh, that I don't get the couch. Is that something Even, that you just decided men do? <laughs> and you're just like, <laughs> so I, I I'm going to be yeah. like a dude now. I'm a grown man. No, yeah. no one just, touches my chair. It's just, like, just turn it around. It's like this famously comfortable chair it's in true. my household. <laughs> Because the layout didn't <laughs> allow it. And, and like, my mom, I had to beg her to let... It's this big leather blue chair. I had to beg her to let me bring it. And she was like, you better not spill shit on it. You better not, like, let other people get it dirty. So, like, my friends would sit on the arm part. Which I'm like, this is an antique. Like, you yeah. cannot sit on the arm. <laughs> and push they, them off. they'd always be like, Hold what? Up. It's just a chair. Like, I, that used to piss me off. So just I'd be like, a Fuck chair? It. Yeah, I'd be like, fuck it. This is an heirloom. It's a chairloom. <laughs> so I'd be like... Uh, no one sits here. This is my chair. And then to, uh, to keep my mm. turf, I'd have to sit there. And, oh, God, I had a roommate who dated yeah, a, a girl cost. who I'd come home after working, you know. I'd be like, oh, fuck, I just want to drink a beer, sit in my chair. <laughs> She'd be watching everything in the living room's mine. She'd be watching this TV, watching my TV in my chair. And I'd be like, you don't live here. You don't pay rent or anything. <laughs> I'm like, hey, can I watch? Like, I want to watch something. And she'd be like, yeah, yeah, after this. And she'd watch, like, the worst fucking shows. Maybe an hour-long episodes. And I'd be like, oh, oh God, oh, God I guess. Dude, I have never lived with a roommate yeah, before. I would, I would sit behind her with a hammer, and I'd just be like, no. Like, no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't no. think I could handle that shit. Yeah, be, that's I'd not, that's not thing, that's his roommate's nose. girl, Ooh, yeah, right? Yeah, it's not my, my roommate. Yeah. He would know better. Just, <laughs> I walk in there, nobody. he's in my chair. They, they clear out. Mm. But she was like, yeah, whatever, I'll move in a minute. She was a bitch, dude. She was a horrible you roommate girlfriend. You should have punched her in the head, I dude. I should have, dude. And even my friend, like, I'd come home and they'd all be sitting. They'd, she'd be in the chair and everybody'd be like, oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, they, they thought you were, yeah. Uh, hey, you uh, had, you had to make an the, example the of her. He looks like he's real tuckered out from work. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he's yeah, got a six-pack. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. He's already drank four of them on the drive home. Yeah. <laughs> he's got his hammer. Yeah. yeah. And, like, I'm not, like, I don't think I'm a confrontation. I actually hate confrontation. <laughs> and I'm kind of a, a people pleaser. But, like, apparently I have an error when you live with me of, like, people don't like to argue with me. Or, like, people are, like, they're not. In, it's, like, I don't know. Okay. My roommates, we got in a big thing once. Because I'm, like, why didn't you just tell me it bothered you? And they're, like. Dude, like, we don't like to, like, you know, like, we don't want to make you mad. Like, I'm not, like, a scary guy, but at times I can be. If you sit in my chair, yeah, yeah. there might be a demon that comes out, dude. I might choke you out just till you fall asleep. You wake up in your bed, and you're like, was that a dream? You look in the mirror, and the makeup rubs off, and there's, finger, there's fingerprints on your neck. It wasn't a dream. It wasn't a dream. Just shit like that, where it's like, come on, everyone does it, but... I don't know. I God, I I like having roommates, honestly. But it's like I should applaud I you. By the way, what what age were you when this whole chair saga was? Twenty. Oh my God. You had you had your own chair at twenty. Yeah, twenty. Dude, that okay. 19. So. That my only experience with like people moving out early is my brother, and he like moved out at eighteen, got a house with some of his friends. And then, and by the way, got into the house based off my mom, like, v like yeah. kind of vouching for him. And yeah. <clears throat> he gets in there, just absolutely wrecks the house. Like, it just yeah. almost uh. has to be, like, gutted. They had so many parties there. But, like, did, oh, my, my brother came home one time and he sees the top of something's head sitting 
in his chair. In his chair. You don't sit in his chair. Your response oh, was fuck. asking her to move. My brother thought someone had broken in and fell asleep in the chair and so pulled a gun on it and it was a blow up doll someone had, put, had left in the living room. Oh, yeah. What in my chair? I like how you see someone sleeping and go like the first thing you think is someone broke in and they fell asleep like, in my you, chair. You know, does that, like yeah. bears do that. Like cartoon animals do that. Like a person doesn't. A person oh, doesn't. They, they it's ate fucking all the insane. Honey and they yeah. Someone, <laughs> someone that breaks in and falls asleep, that's like that's like a sign of like mental disorder. If you're that calm during yeah. a b and E, you know? Yeah. You're committing a crime and you're like, eh, I'll take a nap while I'm here. It's a good, yeah, In which case you out. should pull a gun because you're gonna no. need to shoot him a couple times. <laughs> yeah. that, 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 tired. that cool, calm and collected. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess I moved out at 18 for college because you had to live in a dorm, and then I never lived at home after that. But, like, my dorm was all right. It was, I always like to keep, like, a pretty, you know, I, tight ship. I think, I think when I got in an apartment, I started buying, like, furniture at Goodwill, and I bought, like, the Miles Davis poster and shit. Like, that's when I was like, okay, furniture helps. So you would get your first lamp, and you're like, I'm never going to use overhead lighting again. <laughs> yeah. God, I... <laughs> And then it's like, if you can't stop noticing it, then when you hang out with your other, like, college-age friends, and you're like, Jesus Christ, guys. Like, they've got, like, a like a Bud Light fucking, the cardboard, like, beer wall, and they're using the overhead fluorescent lighting. It's like, you live like this? Like, with the really ceiling are? fan uh, wobbling. Yeah, so the lights like, going, rrr, 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 I like, an interrogation that shit doesn't scene. bother other, like, I feel like when, Only when the podcast table. inevitably <laughs> fails, like, yes. I'm going to become, like, a... Like a streamer designer for my streamer friends, because it's like streamers are one of the worst of like their rooms are so barren and their apartments are so barren. Like Omid, Devin, all these people. It's like eh, you're cool guys, but why don't you have one lamp? You know, why don't you have they need one? a queer eye for the streamer yeah. guy? Yeah, or, yeah call it cool. so cooler than that. Like streamer you know what the guy. biggest <laughs> leap is, is going from <laughs> posters. To frames on frames, things. Yeah. yeah once yeah. something no, has a frame huge. on it, you're like an adult. I don't have frames on these two right now. Yeah, nothing but frames. Oh, okay. Well, this poster yeah. too. I need to get all three of these frames. Frames are fucking oh. expensive, dude. Look at these. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the problem, though. It's, it's like uh, a post. If you frame a poster, it's like, dude, the frame costs more than this. Poster. The one on the oh, right's the, badass. The, the lights blocking cool. it, it's a, like a painting of three guys at a strip club. And the stripper's body is like the funniest part. Hold on. <laughs> what the so fuck? So crudely drawn. <laughs> yeah, didn't focus <laughs> on it at all. Dude, the one. Uh, it's, uh, my wire can't get over there. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I love this one. Oh, I think you were talking about this one the other day. Yeah, I, I bought another one of his. Oh, you can see all my pipes. His works. One of his works. Michael Finster bought another Michael Finster. Original. <sighs> Michael Finster original. Oh, yeah, A copycat no. to his grandfather. Yeah, pretty much exactly. <laughs> oh really? Yeah, they have the exact same style, <laughs> but he's sick fun animation. cheaper. Yeah, sick animation he's original. Hit. It's probably it's probably a sick animation. Oh. Ah. Brian, what's up, man? <laughs> Right. Yeah, two cool, two cool mom <laughs> stories. I was about to say you when you're talking it. about the uh, depressing overhead oh, the, lighting, the I just yeah. looked over at Brian and he's yeah. being like, well, it just actually, this I don't blue think it, light. it actually doesn't yeah. bother a lot of people. Dude. But then, like, I'll have friends yeah. come over upstairs and they'll be like, "Oh man, I wish I could do this." I'm like, "You could, do, like, yeah. you just go to fucking use furniture, or Goodwill or something. Like, it's really not hard to, to get a fucking rug and get a lamp. Damn." <laughs> It's like instantly better. Yeah, and and honestly, it yeah having like anything it a, except people. for overhead lighting. Although I do have I have track lighting in my living room and I like it, but it's indirect. It shoots like up into yeah. the ceiling and it shoots like over onto walls. And, I, and stuff. like it depends. It depends on the time of day. Like I'm talking like it'd be nighttime and we're hanging yeah. out watching a movie. One light like, bulb can, in the middle, just like can blasting. I turn this light off? And they're like, no, well, don't worry about It'll it. It'll be like, pitch black in here. <laughs> we turn that off. We have no other light source <laughs> until the we're sun comes. A up. Movie. I'm like, <laughs> like you want to disarm for watching a movie. I got I had one I love these guys but it was like once I was living here already and was like I'm pretty set in like I need cozy and I'd go to their place to like party and I'd wake up the next day like hungover and just be in like a college fucking boy house totally like shit all over the floor and on the table it'd give me like such bad anxiety 
Where I'd be like, I need to be home. Like, I need to get home, dude. And there's no <laughs> my lamps. oil diffusers yeah. and my yeah. lamps. Yeah. Like, oh, my God, Febreze. is there even a candle in this place? <laughs> yeah, it was, it's just like, it's just like a damn bitch. You really live like this? But they had other priorities. They're working on their studies, I guess. And, yeah. You know, it's like all those guys are you know, they're getting way more pussy. There's something. That's why I don't, I don't also don't get a lot of like girl in college where they're just like, I like know the types of guys whose houses they're staying at. It's like there's one sheet, there's one dirty yellow pillow, and yeah. a towel on the bed, and that's it. I'm like, you you're okay with that? That's like, the experience. You're cool with that? It blows my mind. And yeah, but that's like a trope though. At this point, I, I expect yeah, like, it. That's the thing. Yeah. You, do, you gotta you gotta like expect well, better than that. Like uh, or just I don't know. I know a lot of a lot of guys that have. They got hot girlfriends and they're like hot guys and they've got the fucking shittiest little le- setups and even some of them I'm like I know their families are rich like what's going on here what the fuck are you gonna, are you gonna have one? you're loaded you don't even have a sheets you just have one blanket like what is what's happening I don't know not conducive vibes for me at least but each their own there's a couple of people that like growing up you'd go to their house <clears throat> and their house would be like this is kind of the opposite, I feel like. But you go to this person's house and it looks like a staged house. Oh yeah, and but you don't not want to touch in a good, oh, yeah. like, not in a good like way. A... Like it's so like so minimalist. Oh, and so yeah, sparse, and it's like a TV that's way too high up. That like oh, I don't know. No, last time they, it doesn't look like it's ever been turned on. You know? Yeah. <clears throat> and and I... like they have a full kitchen, but you can tell nothing's ever been cooked in there because they just get a fucking yeah. pizza out every night. And it's like, yeah. do people live here? Are you guys like spies or something? My, I grew up, my mom's house was always like very, li- I have to have like a lived in feeling. Like, cause it's very, my mom's house is messy as fuck. My dad calls it the black hole. Cause you, you, your mail gets delivered there on accident. You're never <laughs> seeing it. Like it's shit just gets so twisted around there. It's insane. Or like you lose, you wear a shirt there, you take it off. It's <laughs> gone. You're never going to see it again. <laughs> But, like, also, the, the house has got, like, a lot of cool shit around it, and, like, it feels lived in, you know? The kitchen's got, like, everything's got a lot of personality to it. And, yeah, it's like, you go, I had, a, I had a friend where it's like, his parents were loaded. You go to their house, it's like, I don't want to touch anything. I don't want to fuck with anything. But also, like, it doesn't feel like a family. Like, it doesn't feel like they have two kids. Yeah. It's like, where, how do you guys live like this? Like, how do you have carpet? How do you have white carpet? Like, where, you don't get dirty? <laughs> You don't wear your shoes in the house ever. You know we're animals. We're pro- we have just big fucking. Well, you wear shoes in the house, dude. That's a big I no. stay strapped. I'm unfortunately, yeah. yeah. That's a sin. I, right now, I'm oh not for like the first time. Well, first off, flat feet, so like I gotta have my supports. No. Second off, like my fa- I you would, have to have a I always note, had hardwood yeah. or tile, in it, and it's like, yeah, everyone just walks around. I, I, I also it's a weird thing. I feel a lot more like perfect i feel like i can achieve more in a day when i'm wearing like my tennis shoes bingo like, when i'm wearing my hokas i feel more professional for some reason it feels like why you feel same like you're thing with, like if you, if you wake up doing something if you work from home you wake up don't shower don't put yeah. on your shoes yeah you're, you're not you're gonna like, do shit yeah. at your desk you're gonna be a shit worker yeah <laughs> which yeah, you're I you're immediately you brian know. you're just like i'm i'm gonna disagree with you because I can tell you don't shower, and you probably don't put on shoes when you come down here and clock you in. You, can, you can't tell he doesn't shower. You just assume he. Doesn't I just shower. assume, but yeah, but Brian you, you also like clean. plays yeah. video games all day on the clock. I think so. I'm not gonna I'm say you're the worker, most. Though. I'm yeah. efficient. <laughs> efficient. That's because I finish shit too early. Oh, That's my problem. Okay. Hey, it's not my fault. I work too hard. It's not my fault. <laughs> I'm quick. That's my big flaw. Yeah. I care too much about this company. I, I, I work too hard. I work too efficiently. <laughs> That's not hey. That's Don't this. let your boss I guess know that they'll, they'll ask for more out of you. Yeah. Well, that's that's why I play video secret, games. That's yeah. why I play a healthy <laughs> amount of video <laughs> games. So that they think yeah. I'm He's working too efficient on it. At yeah. this too. He's really good. Before we started this podcast, he was talking about he had a full stack of 64 diamonds. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's a baby. that's a hard worker right there. Yeah. yeah. I think I've lost my love for video gaming a little bit in a sad way. Really? I get, I get it back in spurts. I I hate that I'm so competitive with certain games now at CSGO where it's like, I don't want, I know, I know my role on Twitch. People want to watch me. I would be funny. I'd be goofy. 
I like to win sometimes. <laughs> you know, I don't like it when I play and everyone's like, oh boy, here comes Dumbo playing this fucking game. He'll never win. How bad are you? I'm <laughs> not that bad, dude. But I'm not as good as Devin because he's got like 1,500 hours. But it's like, I yeah. want to. On what? CSGO? I don't, I don't, yeah. Like, I don't want disrespect, you know? Yeah. I want. I want to be a. Com I want to be competitive. Hit up aim labs. I want to compete. Well, you know, I've been playing it a lot, but it's definitely not like as good of a stream as if I was just doing something funny. But I, sometimes I don't give a shit. Yeah. If that's what it takes for me to like a video game, <laughs> that's fine. Because I haven't liked anything <laughs> for a while. Me. I'm like Skate Three and CS:GO right now. Everything else, fuck it. Damn, that's like a portal from 2012, I know. 2010 era. <laughs> I know. How are there no new games out that I like? All my friends play League of Legends in CSGO. I'm like, what the fuck's happening? Like, League of Legends is like a cancer. Well, it's just like, you CSGO 2 was announced, and everybody's like, let's go play yeah. CSGO 1. That's why but, it's probably well, again. I, I, I you know what the huge change with CSGO 2 is? Smokes. Smoke grenades. Yeah. Smokes, yeah. that's it. Slightly Bigger, better different. smokes. Yeah, slightly different I smokes. Didn't even, I didn't even know that was a thing, and I started streaming, and everyone's like, you getting excited for CS2? I'm like, I thought that was a joke at first, because that doesn't yeah. sound like a real thing, CSGO 2. Yeah. And I looked it up, and I'm like, it's like a fucking update. Like, it's just like a yeah. it's just like a little bit of a graphic overhaul, it seems. But yeah, Are they changing like, the engine, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. Is it free? Uh -huh. I yeah, probably. Probably, I mean, yeah. I spent like fucking two hundred dollars on cases in the last fucking oh, two weeks, so it's like, God damn! I know. Well, I know I have an. Damn, I know. I, well, but last gross. night I pulled. No, last night <laughs> yeah, I pulled a two. Buy the skin. I pulled, well, uh, I know. It's, well, where's the fun? It's like going to a casino. But I, yeah, I, 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 I pulled a two hundred dollars skin yesterday. I'm like, wow! After all that yeah, time, I back. break probably not even even. <laughs> um, but I don't know. Like, I won't gamble at a casino because I'm like, I have an addictive personality. I shouldn't do that. It'll be very bad. Give yourself but a limit. But then I'm like, it's oh. video game. It's just video <laughs> game. And so I got offered. I, I opened, but you're games. getting stuff in return. You're getting skins. Yeah, I'm getting. Yeah, skins. you're true. basically you never, yeah, buying you something. You just nothing. don't know what you're buying. Gambling, you could just, just go. I'm just buying really, really bad skins, like 99% of the <laughs> yeah, time. Yeah, we're going to use, like, garbage, yeah. And, like, I, I opened, like, four cases on my first stream doing it. I immediately got an email sponsorship opportunity from a CSGO gambling site. And I was like, oh, my God. Oh, fuck yeah, like, free skins. And Z Chum and Devin were like, dude, you can't do that. That's immoral. Like, you're going to get your audience hooked on gambling. I'm like, what? They love it. Like, they love it. That, that, was, that yeah. was the main concern. They would do it yeah. if, it were, if well, I weren't here. Yeah, they were like, that, you can't do that. Like, you can't gamble on Twitch and do this shit. And like, like oh, wait, you can't gamble either. on Twitch? You can, though. People no, you have can't. the sponsor. But you, sh I think it is banned. But this site, I've seen people have the sponsorship. But everyone's like, you shouldn't do it. You shouldn't do it. And so I didn't do it. They just want it for themselves. Yeah, that's they jealous, want dude. my skins. I would, I think that would get sponsored by like an actual gambling site. Like, where you could do like poker and stuff, but not like a, like, like yeah. a game yeah, gambling. <laughs> a poker well, one. Dude, oh. no, you don't want to go down that route because then you're on kick in yeah. a fucking week. You don't want to be, you don't want to start gambling. You start doing just like you're just sitting there fucking do, being a slot junkie well, all day. I, I can do everything yeah. in moderation. You know, I think I know when no, to call you, it quit. No, uh, you wouldn't. Once yeah, you this guy, it, he can just in a blink of an eye quit, quit. weed, quit some tr anything. No. Quit porn. You know, I've. Anything. Porn, yeah. Quit. quit. I've quit. Breathing. Weed because I ran out and there's nothing I can do about it unless I tried a little bit, and I think it's actually been quite good for me except for when I went to Florida and I, all my family I think now any smokes change weed. You is, ran is out? Good. Yeah, I ran out and uh, I yeah. thought some guy like mailed you a million dollar fortune. Like yeah, well, super... yeah, dude, that lasted about a fucking week and uh, <laughs> yeah, I blew through it. Through. And then he offered he oh. offered to send more and I was like, I really need to do like. I want to work out and be more active. If I smoke weed, I will just That's it. I'll just go puff snacks and I will literally eat until I'm like sick. And then I'll just go to bed and be like, oh. <laughs> I'm like, my metabolism's yeah. not gonna last forever. <laughs> if I keep eating like this, I'm gonna be a fucking fat bitch. Like I gotta work a little. I gotta give a little of my vices. So I, I quit weed for about three days and I've been picking up CSGO gambling <laughs> in its stead. <laughs> yeah, it's a good uh, substitute. Balance. Yeah. Balance. Uh, I, I, I refuse to give up the uh, the, the weed. You shouldn't. Yeah. And you shouldn't. The devil's you lettuce. You know the best is when I can just wait till it's nighttime and then I'll do it.
No, yeah, that, that's that's, that's all I. Well, I don't I don't yeah. wait until nighttime. I actually uh, usually start. He does it yeah. all day. He's like, obsessed. Uh, right after breakfast is usually no. I'm when, I the in, he, no, no. when I was in the Florida, my family yeah, it'd be like noon there. I'm like. Every day there, I went on a bike ride. I'd ride for like 15 miles. You know, I was getting my tan. I was working out. I get back there like, you want to get high? I'm like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. Like, I didn't think this would ever happen. Like, with you guys. Come on. Yeah. Everyone there yeah. had a fucking dugout with one one hitters in it. And they're like, you want to get high, man? You want to get high? Like, when did you turn into a bunch of hippies? Like, what, what's happening? Yeah. What's happening to my family? <laughs> And uh, yeah, it's actually really badass though, because it does kind of bring us <laughs> yeah. closer as a unit. I remember a couple months ago when I I went somewhere. My like I never talked to my stepsister really, and she was like, "You want to smoke weed?" I'm like, "You're not bad, you know. You're not. Maybe, yeah, not, you're maybe I'm cool. not giving you enough credit." Oh, dude, cousin, I had this photo aunt, like, like you want to smoke. I went on that. Like, I thought you were talking about your like little sister. No, like, no. Uh, I went on the. She's like, like ten years old. You want to get high? Yeah, you want, you want to smoke up. <laughs> Oh my god! I went on this uh, say, this camping trip with my dad, and I did. I got him insanely oh. high before bed, oh. and I <laughs> he was like, I, I had his like he had one of those the crumple cowboy hats that you have. Uh, oh, nice! But That's his it? has like a little like feather yeah. in it or something. Does oh, yours have badass. a feather? No, it has like That's a little version. leather yeah, band that, with a little that, feather. Fifteen dollars extra for that. And, yeah, and, that was... uh, and I was like, dude. Uh, he, he was like, where should I put this? It, no, he was cold, and I, he had a hoodie on. Feather. It. <laughs> he had his hat, but he also had a uh, jacket. I was like, just take off your hat, put on your hood, and then put the cowboy hat back on. <laughs> and he was like, okay. And then he did it and like cinched up the strings a little bit. And so it was like cinched around his head with a cowboy hat, just like resting on top. And like right before bed, I was just like, hold on, I have to get a picture of this. And I had a Polaroid, <laughs> and I took a photo, and... I was like, oh, I was like, that, this is a good memory. I got my dad high as shit first time smoking with him, yeah. and then I, An I just have him looking like a dumbass with a <laughs> cowboy hat on top of a hood, yeah. and uh, the the photo came out white. Uh, it is uh, just a complete. Uh, I saw it the next morning. I was like, shit, no, do it that again, sucks. dad. It's funny, <laughs> yeah, dad. Yeah. Eight in the morning, fucking yeah. smoke this, yeah. smoke this weed. Great, put, put this, this on. hat on. Yeah. <laughs> It was like I've never talked to my dad while he's like uh, blasted before, and like I was talking to him, he'd be like, "What? What'd you say?" And I'm like, hey. and like they all handle it way like because they they know it's Brian. Smoke. That's basically yeah. Brian. Brian they, they well, completely yeah, disengages yeah. from yeah. life. No, I yeah. agree. And I, my dad Dude, was like, "Put I you, solely like, my body." It was cool though because I like showed him a bunch of rap he'd never heard, and he's like, "This shit's so good. Like this goes hard." This shit but, slaps, like, son. They all. Everyone in that family started smoking like kind of recently, like the last year or two. And they all think, like, when they're like, here, like, be really careful. Take like one. I'm like, I've been smoking for like six years straight. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, you got more of that? Like, I'm killing yeah. it. And one night we're all out there in a fucking a golf cart. This place, you know where it is, Sam. Like, normally there's not like a lot of partiers there in Florida. Yeah. And they pulled in on a golf cart into our yard while we we're all out there. And everyone's like, like freaking out and i walked over there i'm like you guys okay and the whole golf cart of people they didn't say a single thing when i said that and there's a bunch of like drunk kids and i like yelled it loud and then i started being like this is weird and they backed out and pulled yeah. away and everyone's like like oh my god you like talked it like I, that was awesome like, yeah, I just, like, spoke to other people and they're like the chosen like, one everyone was so scared when they pulled in what? i'm like, like, yeah, they're, like yeah. pa paranoid or yeah they just get like they're like what's like police or something like yeah. they're, they're, like, they're like kids when they get high oh, still okay. like yeah. they're all like uh, yeah. that's like, like such a strange reaction yeah. to have well it's like it was like two like 40 year old high, like you know? two like almost 50 year old men and me and i was like oh i got this guy so we can check on like, like sit back pops i just was like you guys okay didn't say a word they drove off and i was like i was heralded as a, like a brave brave yeah, they held you off. yeah. <laughs> you do that oh. you're, you're, you're so uh, cool yeah uh, what if you would have seen your eyes all red and stuff yeah. Yeah, he could have well, shot well, you. Like, well, then I was like, I probably looked really creepy because when they pulled in, they, we were behind a wall because, you know, Florida, everything on the beach is like up. Yeah. So we're under the house behind yeah, a wall. Florida. And I just came out from around the corner in the dark. It was like midnight. Oh. No lights on. I just come out I'm like, you kids okay? 
And then they peel out. I'm like, well, it probably looked weird. Like, it probably, probably was a little creepy. They were there. probably, like, on a family trip or something, and there were two <laughs> dudes that were trying to get away from the family and mm. jerk each other off or something. No, no, it was the whole, it was interrupted the whole thing them. full. I was with was two packed. dudes. Oh. They, they were a golf cart full of kids. He was getting jerked off. Kids? How many kids? Jerked. I don't know. They're probably high schoolers. Probably six. It was like a it was like a three row golf cart. <laughs> um, it's like a high oh, schoolers were trying to find a place to have an orgy, and you yeah, do it yeah, do yeah, a random driveway off. where there's cars. <laughs> yeah. oh, that's a good spot for our Stephen King orgy. Come yeah. yeah. like, on, hell yeah! I know, spraying them, <laughs> throwing rocks at them, and spraying. Them. Oh, man, oh. You can't park that air. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, kids, okay? Not gonna answer me, okay? That's fine. <laughs> yeah. In about two seconds to reply before I started screaming and <laughs> spraying. God, I could kill you! I'll kill you! <laughs> yeah. Dude, I wonder why my though. mouth is so fucking dry. So what are you eating? It's because I'm eating nothing but pistachios, dude. Yeah. It's like I can't get any fucking moisture in here. Probably had like eight ah. servings of pistachios. Did you get a drink? There you go. It's oh. burger juice. Yes, nice. burger juice. <laughs> ah, quenching. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, I man. honestly, you know what? Oh, I just almost shit my pants. What? <laughs> I think this has been Too a good crazy. episode. I was very concerned about it, though. I, I know I haven't I spoken anything in like twenty minutes because I've been yeah. absolutely just like, my could my mouth be Should any fucking drier? Well, I can talk a lot, so it's you know it's easy. Yeah, oh, like dear God. Talk. But like earlier today, the 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 source of my doubts on this episode, Abby was like, "Let's go to Chick Fil A." <laughs> <laughs> she was, she always mm. chooses to fucking just like mm. make my afternoon stressful, like right before a podcast, <laughs> which is like when uh, it, that's when I'm like at my worst because I'm just like I just put the kids in bed and I just come downstairs angry and it's I'm good just time like, to do your job. Rah, rah, rah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And today she was like, "Let's go to Chick Fil A, and like the kids will play up on the playground and shit, and then <laughs> oh. uh, and I'll go get the food, and and you watch them in the playground. So I, you know, the stupid like tubes and everything. Play for ten minutes. Yeah, yeah. Basically, Less. they they love that shit. Anyway, so I'm sitting in there in, in like the room that just smells like kids' feet, Ugh. and my youngest one is potty trained. Oh, I don't like where this is going. Yeah." <laughs> Yeah, right. So she this doesn't have a diaper on, but she is potty trained. She's very good about it. And uh, and then she goes up this little thing. This the first time she's been old enough to go up into the tube works above oh, yeah. my head and then oh. come down the slide. But up Scary. there, they have distractions. There's like a little car <laughs> that they can go in and act like they can drive. There's like a little propeller thing. And uh, so she goes up there. One of them was a toilet. And <laughs> Madeline comes yeah. down the fucking slide and goes back up. And then Madeline comes down the slide and goes back up. And I'm like, Madeline, I haven't seen Olivia in some time. Mm-hmm. I'm looking through like the the fucking bottom of the tires, and I'm like, I don't I don't see her in the car anywhere because you can kind of see up into it. I'm like, you need to go find her up in this tube somewhere. Yeah, she was squatting by the aviation department, Ugh. pissing, uh. pissing up in the tubes. <laughs> oh, and I'm sorry what you, what if you're you? the the guy. I know the manager of this Chick Fil A is a fan. <laughs> <laughs> there oh, might be oh my. some kid piss up in the <laughs> aviation oh, department. Oh, I don't even fucking tell anybody. I'm not gonna crawl up there and mop it up. I know the kid came down wet. Dude, you're just letting kids play in that piss. Kids playing in that piss. Yeah, dude. What the fuck? No, I, I, okay, so here's the problem. Is a, she's so young that, I mean, she's like not even two, I don't think. No, she, she's like, she's two. Um, when she <laughs> pees, <laughs> when she <laughs> pees, <laughs> she's around there somewhere. Yeah, I'm, I'm like the opposite of, of, of Abby. Abby will be like, oh, yeah, she's like 38 months. I'm like, what? Uh, Man, yeah. Months? What the hell? <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, math and shit? What the hell? I'm just like I don't know, like one or two or something. Yeah. She's she's around yeah. more around the two one. A little bit further before. Um, nephews and siblings. Yeah, Damn. but when they pee themselves, sometimes there can be a dr- a little like it looks like someone left an ice cube on the floor and it melted. You know, um, oh, just oh. like a little like a little oh. a little dollop of of liquid on the floor. But you didn't go up there, so you have no idea. I have no idea. Could it? Yeah. It could have been all caught she by a pants, or it too. could yeah. there could be a little dribble, a little tiny yeah. little dribble. It's pour. It's seeping yeah. through the yeah. fucking. This be the one time where jungle, she just yeah. does a huge it, piss, yeah. big old piss, <laughs> like a whole bottle. Yeah. 
So anyways, uh, that, that oh, and then when it goes time to go, I'm like, hey, guys, kids, let's go. No kid comes down the slide for like six minutes. Oh, oh kids, oh God. get the fuck down out of the fucking oh, tubes. God. And there's other kids there, so I don't want to like like raise my voice and be like, yeah. I'm coming up there, I'm going to fucking beat the shit out of you. <laughs> yeah. Like, imagine your kid's in there, and all of a sudden this like grown-ass man is climbing up into the tubes. Yeah. <laughs> Pissed off. Yeah. Like fucking you. bright red. Where are you? Like, imagine you're a kid in the tubes, yeah. and all of a sudden a grown-ass man... Yeah. Comes into your realm, you know? Yeah. That, that would have been. looks like you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, they, yeah. They were hiding out up there. And so I was like, kids, if you don't come down, you're not going to get any ice cream. Immediately, these fuckers come down. And uh, and then we had to go fucking get ice cream, you know? Take and then there was all. fights over that. And so yeah, the whole time, I, I was telling you guys <laughs> earlier, like, I've been having blood pressure problems. Yeah. Turns yeah. out my blood pressure is actually great. It's only skyrocketing when I'm around my family, my very beloved dear ones. Half, half your day, yeah, half, half your fucking day, day is, when I'm around these great stress. These fucking kids <laughs> and my wife. It's I I checked it earlier. Like it was it was like when I thought I was chill, you know. But I'll admit there had been a fight over Big some ice cream and a Mickey Mouse uh, stuffed animal, and um. I, I checked my blood pressure. Oh, and Abby just came around the corner and looked at me and was like, oh, so you're just going to leave the door open? I was like, you know I didn't. Like, it would have to be one of the kids. Like, I, I'm yeah. not the person that leaves shit open. I lock every deadbolt before I, or like after I walk through it. I always close doors. Oh, that's genius. You blame the kids for yeah, that. Yeah. No, I, I, well, yeah, I blame kids on a lot of and shit. And one of the yeah. kids peed up yeah. there. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it was a kid. It was it me. Look, it was just drops. But uh, <laughs> I thought I was chill. I took my blood pressure super fucking high. I'm going to track this. I'm going to take it in the afternoon. How do you take your blood pressure? I have a blood pressure Stab cuff. Yourself. You have like one of those. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, no, yeah. no. It's like a cuff that does it automatically. It's like. Oh. you read the number. Yeah. Oh, How do you read cool. numbers? <laughs> that's that's where like it gets complicated. That's but, magic. Yeah, I get Abby to read it for yeah. me. I'll be honest. Ooh, yeah. she gives you a thumbs up or a thumbs <laughs> yeah, down. Yeah. yeah, but I'm gonna check it in the afternoon, and then I'm gonna check it in the late in the evening. I believe is what it's called. Right when you're about to have a ram. Yeah, no, no, not no. Yeah, like and when I'm dealing with the fucking kids, I just want to see how much higher oh, my blood you're... pressure is when I'm around my family versus yeah. when I'm just uh, chilling by myself. Peak. Yeah. But, what's what's like peak kid stress hour? Um, the moment they get home until the moment mm -hmm. I fucking knock them out <laughs> in their bed, force them to sleep. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta we gotta play some one up again at some point for some. That shit is dope. I found out how to do the team versus the solo, by the way, and Ooh. it's actually very basic that I was missing for like three streams. But we should do that for the next two episodes. Team versus yeah, the solo. Because yeah. when yeah. I was playing with my friends, I'm like, how do like when we all played one up, we we're each on our own team. Mm -hmm. I was playing with my yeah. friends. It was like, it was two and two, and we're on teams. And I was like, what the fuck is going on? Stupid. It was easy to fix. I like every I man for how, himself. Yeah, I like every man for himself, too. Yeah. And also with the yeah. contest, Sam, like we did one where it was like, this isn't what with we want. There was a map where it's like exactly like you go through, you rack up points, you can do vert, you can do just regular shit. It's cool. Oh. I've now like flushed out all the all the game modes I want to play. While we're in and, that vein, yeah, by so. the way, I'm usually not one to get hype for games, but Skate 4 is on the horizon. Skate 4 is looking good. Uh, there was a leak, uh, and then the people that were hosting, okay. it was like a multiplayer leak, and the people that were hosting it got a, a big uh, cease and desist, but apparently... Wait, it's got multiplayer? There was for the playtest, yeah. They're running on like private servers. Oh, dude. But they're, I play they're running that. like alpha, pre-alphas that are yeah. closed, Jeez. that they're invite only, and... and People seem to be having a blast doing those on like these, like these hosted servers or whatever. You excited for the parkour? Yeah, it looks awesome. Uh, that game, yeah. Star Wars: uh, Fallen Order, and Dark and Darker, though, really the only games I'm looking forward to. Or Jedi uh, Survivor. Fucking Dark I and Darker's never come out. I know, out. but if Dark and Darker now Kinchy doesn't too. come out, uh, I'm gonna freak out. out. What's yeah. with Dark and Darker? Is it gonna come out? Is it not gonna come out? Is it up I don't in the air? Know, man. You know what? Uh, well, in contacted me and he was like, "Hey, dude, you need to make like a stink about this whole Dark and Darker thing." Yeah, and, fuck Nexon, dude. And um, because he was going to, he's like, we should spread the word and stuff, well, Mr. Activist and everything. And I was like, yeah, I'm totally gonna do that because I still have some footage from Dark and Darker I want to get rid of. But uh, oh nice. Now the more I'm looking into it, you know what? I'm gonna sit back and not be 
kind of a like you know critical came out and he's just like all these assets are from like unreal and like these are just easy assets to get and i'm 100 percent on iron mace's side and at the same time the yeah. more i look into the story there might be something there i don't know i'm, I'm gonna been sitting pussy i'm gonna <laughs> sit I, it, yeah. cause it, it's, well, who cares if you're wrong okay i do like dark and darker <laughs> I do like it, but you love yeah. Dark and Darker. I love it, but if this guy did have the game like on a private server at his house, and was like trying to lure his colleagues to come work at a company at Iron Mace at the time while he was still employed at Nexom, you know, I feel like any any IP that's made while you're on the clock should belong to the company that you're working for. No, oh, yeah, they make you sign a contract yeah. for that exactly. And thing. and you know, so while I a, don't like that outcome, you know, I I liquor. get it. They have a yeah. win, they have a winning case. Is what you're not a winning case. I think it would have they would have to get down to actually just like looking at the code to see if it's the same. Because I'm just gonna say it: humans are lazy. You know, they say we we rebuilt it from the foundations up, but if they thought there was a shred of possibility they could get away with just being lazy as fucking building on the the previous build they had. They probably did it. Yeah, I think they it's, they might have it's taken that it. That different. Come on, are they gonna prove it? Uh, I, I mean, I don't. I don't yeah. think it's. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. The whole point is, about this these situation. are businesses, dude. These are not emotional things. Oh, yeah. Like these guys aren't gonna just go like, "You took it." I know. But We're taking you, your game. Why can't you just be wishful? Yeah. No. They all they're gonna ask for is royalties. I bet they're gonna be like, "Give us ten percent of your profits." I bet they ask for yeah. half. Maybe next time will well they'll they'll try to argue half. I would say. If I was them, I would. I would say, give me half of everything. Half? Yeah. And still make the game, of course. That's the only way I'm making money on this. But, yeah. But Nexom's also just a scummy that. company. That's what they're going for. They just want some money. They want they're like, whoa, I get money you know? based off a game I don't even have to develop? That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, of course they're going to sink some legal cash into this. They're going to throw as much as they can at it. Makes me sick. It does make All me my sick. three games I'm looking forward to. And I think really it's coming back. To the I think it's coming back, but I, well, they might yeah, have hopefully. to. They might have to pay next on something. They take the yeah, L. Game they four, we can all be happy for, yeah, it. We and can. we are all happy and excited for Star Wars Jedi Survivor. I saw you can have a what mullet on your guy or something. Uh, it's the oh, it's wow. the Dark Souls E. It's better. Uh, Star Wars game. You you saw Fallen Order, I'm sure, Brian. There's a first, oh, it's a sequel. Yeah, it's it's, it's a apparently sequel, also like. And incredibly, like everything fans asked for, for them to put in it, they've added. Like very listen to sequel, which it makes me very excited because the first one I fucking loved. I beat it twice. It's the stream or I, I completely blacked out playing that game, and it's the <laughs> first time in one of those like games with those kinds of fighting where I finally realized, like, oh my god, parrying versus just rolling every time. Like I finally got the timing down when I was like blackout drunk. Like I hit a. I had a moment where, like, a boss, I just, like, no hit a boss where I'm like, uh, 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 like, I had to delete the VOD. I had to delete all evidence of it because it was a sponsored Voodoo Ranger stream where I drank, like, I drank, like, eight tall wasted. boys and was just like, oh, uh, and I just ranted about Star Wars. I don't really, I couldn't even watch the VOD because I was so embarrassed because people said, <laughs> like, someone just brought up the current state of Star uh, Wars and I just, like, went off on, like, a 40-minute tangent. It was just like, uh, uh. And that's I'm really sure uh, Zunu Ranger why? loved that you deleted. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've had to delete like two of their <laughs> VODs. I'm like, sorry. You always it's get better for up. you if I delete yeah. it. Yeah, it's for you and thank me. You're really not getting what yeah. you paid for here, but it's, it's better like, yeah. exactly yeah. what you paid for. Because I'm like, this shit rocks. It makes me feel happy. Look, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I smile. But uh, yeah, oh, no, yeah, I'm really looking forward to that sequel. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, one of my top three games. Like it, yeah. uh, Looking forward to. Uh, well, I, I all the games that I want sequels of or like additions to are all the games that that have no goddamn development team behind them. Like Kenji has like, like the one smallest. Guy. Kenji two. Kenji two. I yeah, keep it's, seeing it's like release like concept art, not concept art, but like in game shots and stuff. It looks so fucking great. Yeah. And I've been yeah. playing Kenji again, and that's like one of the best games I've ever fucking played. I love it and. I just feel like uh, that's just gonna take forever. Exanima, when when the fuck are we getting know. multiplayer? Exanima, two people. That guy left. He's gone, dude. I haven't seen him. Who Exanima guy? He made yeah. He made like an update like 
a year ago, and I haven't seen shit since. I, I think he had like one in no January. No multiplayer, like nothing, December. dude. Did yeah, he? big update. What did it say? It wasn't, it wasn't like awesome, though. It wasn't like world-shattering, like multi. I heard they were going to have multiplayer for the arena, so at least we could battle each other. But, I mean, yeah, I guess that's all right. But I want, I want yeah. to wander the Throw dungeon. Campaign. Yeah, I want to wander the dungeon together. But it's like those it games, examiner? Dark and Darker. Yeah, exactly. I think has a. I mean, they they have a sizable Better team now that's super successful. But in the beginning, it was definitely just a small team, and having to One wait. Thief. On, yeah. And a lawsuit. Yeah. A thief and a loser working together <laughs> yeah. to steal code that isn't there. <laughs> yes, the righteous Nexon's yeah. code. I am <laughs> Nexon's puppet. <laughs> no, I just, I just didn't like because people you were acting nark to like them that Wellens plotting an uprising. <laughs> <laughs> an uprising. Yeah, I'll get to well, I, I'll I'll get people to just out treat early. it like it's internet drama. Like there's like, yeah. well, did you see Iron yeah. Man's rebuttal? It kind of completely like makes him oh. innocent. And I'm like, dude, okay. It doesn't matter what you say. I mean, wait, wait. Can prove in court, and it's going to court. This doesn't matter what we care about. Speaking of rebuttals yeah. and internet drama, have you at all? Like, I don't want to get into it too much because it's so fucking oh. boring. But the creator class drama and what, dude? Oh, with the creator it's class big, drama, it's juicy. No, no, and I, I, I listen. I'd never been in a Twitter drama? listening space before. And there's one one night where it's Team Star and, um. Froggy Fresh and all of Froggy Fresh's crew and all of Sam Hyde's crew and Sam Hyde and goddamn Harley Mortensen and they were all arguing about this and it was like the most I fucking hate Keemstar dude I hate everything that guy fucking says <laughs> he, he just like all the arguments everyone was making even Harley's like defending goddamn Crater Clash like everyone I'm just like this it felt like a TMZ conversation and now the amount of shit where people are just like bringing it up still every day in such like a desperate attempt to like be in the light about it or like i don't know like a lot of i don't know okay keep in mind i don't know anything about sam hyde's crew but god they seem like a lot of guys where it's like they just are tweeting about this every fucking day and they're all like i'm not gonna donate money to charity unless froggy fresh gets back like what what tactic is this how do they think he's gonna get back by then doubling tripling down and just making such a stink. There's such a fart cloud around the whole thing. What happened? So, Brian, basically, Froggy Fresh was kicked from Creator Clash Ticket, which sucks. Really excited to see Froggy Fresh there because he made a okay. comment about the the one of the showrunners of Creator Clash, iDubs, girlfriends, fucking OnlyFans, oh. and whatever. And he worked out uh, with Sam Hyde and Sam Hyde's band from all these events. And then it honestly all, yeah. was it seemed like a bullshit kick out to me. Okay, yeah, no, that's it, fair. It, it, that's, like he, okay, that's fair. I looked at geez, the lineup like and I was like, it just doesn't blah, seem blah, blah. like it's. No, I just it sucks for no. Chris Reagan because he did all this training. No, Is he still going to be fighting. Yeah, I think they said. Yeah, they like, they get an emergency guy. Yeah, usually, they're right? just going to find yeah. some good for him off the street because. Froggy Fresh looked like he was yoked. Yeah. He looked like he was yeah, going to no, tear Chris Reagan's yeah. fucking head yeah, off. Yeah, lucky. <laughs> but, okay, but like, uh, no, yeah, I don't care. Like, the kickoff, sure, bullshit. But the follow-up of everyone just making it their entire... There's so many people on Twitter talking about where I'm like, get a fucking hobby, dude. Like, god damn. Like, there's just so many insane people talking about it all the time. I'm like, Jesus Oop. Christ. Oop. There's They're a disturbing fucking... side to internet celebrity where, dude. like... They they realize this is their bread and butter. They're just it's like but it's, it's like such a desperate. For, it's such a desperate like yeah. they're making everyone's trying to make it about them or like all of Froggy Fresh and his oh, girls. Like no one's been talking about Froggy Fresh for like ten years. This happens and now he's like tripling they down. To like up. fuck you guys. Like I would have given you a hundred thousand for charity, but now I want and like <laughs> I or uh, fucking Keemstar is talking about like every day like it's breaking international news. I just hate the melodrama of it all. It's like, fuck, he got yeah. kicked off. It was a stupid call. It's over. You're not going to get back on it by acting like this. People are going to like, I don't, I listen, I don't even, I don't want to talk I ill of people. Keem I thought Keemstar, like, I thought he retired. Keemstar is not retired. I see him every fucking day. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, 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 mean, I, I don't think he retired. I listened to like three of the Twitter no, speakings where the shit. way he even but They had more three. than one? They had yeah, more than every, one? Had, they had every night they've been sessions. doing it. And like, Every, the way he's he's developing news on this? Night. No, dude. Yeah. It's, it's developing the same news. gripe? 
the developing news is Keemstar keeps being like, we'll give even more money to have Froggy Fresh put back in it. And then they're like, wow, they hate charity. They're not putting these guys in it for money. It's like, if you care, it's all people being, it, both sides are like, it's really just about charity. And then they're both like, well, then why wouldn't you let Sam Hyde go if he gives you $500,000? And they're like, well, because he, we fucking hate him. And they're like, well, then you hate charity. And they're like, well, then why don't you just give the money anyway if you like charity so much? It's so fucking boring, and I can't stop seeing it. We should talk and, about it some more. <laughs> yeah, no, viewers. Yeah, let's yeah. Talk, yeah. Come on, let's listen first. to Team Star. It's so, yeah. I, I just, even the way he talks, like the way he speaks, and he's like, oh, okay, then you, like, it, it just drives me fucking nuts. It really is, like, one of the worst. Being in that circle, I would, I'm gone. You know I'm what deleted. else I, I, I don't know. Like, it, it does suck for Froggy because it looks like he put a lot of work into this. But I also don't want to see that. I don't want to see people that have prepped for a fight for nine months. I want to see YouTubers fresh out of the yeah, editing I'm chair. Exactly. I and I want to see someone well, like a month throw a training. fucking hammy or something while they're trying to, uh, like, throw a punch at somebody. And well, just then, cripple under their <sighs> own, like... Dude, that was, <laughs> because they, that was they, get, like, they have nothing, you know? When I they're listened in, the fights would last one minute. Yeah, dude. one minute they're winded. Oh, well, haven't dude, even the, hit yeah. yet. The last one was fun as fuck, and it's yeah. like everyone's just like throwing. Am the more amateur the boxing is, normally the more fun because they're not as tactical. Yeah. They're just yeah. throwing fucking punches. I wanted punches. to look like Dexter and Mandark yeah. slapping you, each you other. You wanted to see like backyard <laughs> brawling. Like yeah. it's just people throwing shit. And yeah, Froggy Fresh looks like he would fucking kill Chris Raygun. <laughs> yeah. And then in the thing, Keemstar's like, you know what, Froggy, I've got you for a boxing match. I'll pay you just as much. It's like, problem solved. Froggy will be yeah. in a boxing match. Like, it works fine. But it's like, I don't yeah. even know why they all oh. want to be. I don't know why they want to be in creator class I so bad because they seem to was, hate it. Was retired, but now I realize he has a competing, a competing, yes. uh, competing, boxing whatever thing. boxing thing. Yeah. It's all people That's all for he, limelight. Uh. That's all he's doing. Is he's also, just like, this could it, be a way to promote mine. No, but how does it not yeah. seem so desperate that he's like trying to get people back into the competing one? Like, just focus on your own shit. Bring people into your thing. Like, uh, it's just a bunch of fucking losers. It's really what it seems like. I'm a loser. They're losers. We're, I'm listening. But I don't even... I still don't even Ryan's know what he said. not a loser because he thing. wasn't in that fucking Twitter listening party. <laughs> I saw in there, like, Peanut and Carlos were in there. I'm like, what's going on, guys? This, <laughs> Eating it up. This fucking blows. Like, it's really... Like, twi there's nothing... There's nothing less... It's like TMZ on an even smaller scale. Like, oh, YouTuber beef. Who the fuck cares, bro? Like, no, that's, uh, yeah, that's and one day I, we stuff. will fade into obscurity, and I'm sure I'll be like, "Oh, somebody want to fight me? Like, who wants to fight me? God, what the hell, Froggy Fresh? Go! It's, he, it's like he used to make someone, videos like years I, ago. It's like seeing someone on their deathbed, like, "No, don't take me! Like, go with some <laughs> dignity, dude. Just go get a day job or something." Like, I don't know where he went. He went to nowhere, and now they like brought him to this fighting thing, and now he's having a resurgence. Everyone's pissed he's gone. He's like every day, like, I'm going to do a diss track. Good for him. You know, he's getting publicity, but also he kind of seems like a little asshole. I, I don't know. I don't like anyone involved oh. in this, dude. I just want to, I want to you know what I like about Creator Clash 1. Meeting up with bros and getting drunk. Getting drunk, dude. I go to the bar. Yeah. I watch people fight. I didn't care who was fighting. Yeah. I didn't know anyone but Harley at it. It was a great time. That's what I want for Creator Clash. Would I like to see Froggy Fresh? Of course. I was 12 once. I like I like those couple songs. But now I, it's like, I, Jesus Christ, what a stink they're putting it on at all. I saw his name everywhere, so I was like, I'm going to look him up. And then it, it, he hasn't made, like, a video in years. Oh. Like, it, hmm. like, years, What's years. I don't think it's, like, two years ago. I think it's, like, longer than that. It's, like, oh, long-ass time. I wonder why he's fading into and obscurity. It, well, my question is, is, like, why him? Out of all the people, did, uh, could they just not find like, another like five foot tall guy for Chris Ray? Rain guy. It's like getting, you know, it's like, <laughs> he's on day. Come remember this. On day, yeah. Remember this guy. It's well, just a this, strange I mean, pick for I don't know yeah. for iDubs. I, you would well, think also, you'd be going after like super relevant. It is probably people. hard to find like a five yeah, foot two guy to fight in this fucking boxing thing yeah. that people know. Okay, that's another thing is that you know these people shouldn't train so hard. I want to see like unathletic people fight. And I don't think they should put him like Chris Reagan up against the Harley guy. He's like six eight or something. I want to see him. I just want to see like oddball fights. Duke it yeah, out. Yeah. Where, well, 
you get squished know, yeah. or something. I'm, I'm excited. I want someone to get hurt. hurt. Like, I want someone to get real hurt. This fight. is why you're not hosting it. The fuck? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I want blood. Yeah. Uh, Harley's fighting mm. a like ex WWE fighter Military. who oh, was shit, on cool. the season of Survivor I just watched. And like when I heard it, it's like, oh, Harley's fighting a wrestler. I'm like, yeah, Pisha. And I found out who it was. I'm like, I just watched that guy on Survivor <laughs> season 37, and he was good in the season. Now so I'm like, on that. I'm now I'm like very hyped for that fight. Also, Harley's got like eight inches on him or like six inches, but We're the dude's like here. jacked as fuck. Like the guy Harley is... <laughs> all of a sudden lost a lot of weight too. Yeah, like he eight... should have kept that pillow for yeah. when people are mashing on him. Yeah. All these people that super train athletic, for boxing, dude. Yeah, yeah they're, they're all they're trained like up people so now, like dude. They would all, be yeah. a great excuse. You're a YouTuber. They're like, we'll pay you to train. I'd take I that. that. Like, sure. Yeah, like, yeah. I, won't, I it would be nice to work out for a reason. And you lose. No one gives a shit. You're a YouTuber. You yeah. win. No one really gives a shit. You're a YouTuber. Unless it's, like, some sort of person you have beef with. Or unless something. you, like, million dollar baby yeah, or something. You unless trauma. you kill someone or... Like I don't yeah it's yeah unless it's like there's no like real big beefs though, like that, that I Watson think of. guy like he he got absolutely like, destroyed and it was hilarious oh, yeah. he walked yeah, out people, of there champion yeah. no he one, posted yeah, no his own can. video of his uh, ass getting kicked in oh, slow mo yeah, and it's yeah. like an awesome he's video a, he's a bigger like, man than that's me. how yeah. they yeah. should be done yeah, that I is a textbook how they should be done. And like, that like, it, awesome. that, it's like you almost do want a more drama. Like, why not let Sam Hyde fight Harley or something? You know, why not put these big ass dudes against Sam each other? Hyde should fight Chris Raygun. They, yeah, Chris Raygun well, does sure. not have a fighter. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, but it's like, why would yeah, he, you know? Sure they, what <laughs> Sam Hyde should only do top down punches to try to like and, and squish get, Chris down to the floor. They should do that, punch but down give, on uh, give Chris like. A fucking I don't know a brick on a rope or something like give him like a David <laughs> yeah, yeah, versus yeah, like Goliath a, like give wait, him like a what was game Mad something, Streets something. the character you were playing would do this punch <laughs> <laughs> they do both <laughs> hands a double fisted yeah. punch he should keep trying to do that Ultimate down on Chris's punch. head yeah and Chris should get like uh, a slingshot with a rock or something yeah. like they should yeah, of course we'd like to see like you know deadliest warrior simulated battles but yeah. in a world where it's a bunch of nerds fighting someone's gonna fucking die if you know Sam I'd hit him and cave his chest in or something uh, and it's like it is for a charity like would they love that that charity I yeah know, they would think but, it's awesome yeah, well then they could for, organ it donate it's yeah. for MS I think uh, oh, MS, is MS yeah. something Microsoft. you can contract while getting your ass beat yeah, in the ring? Yeah, while, while, while getting obliterated in a <laughs> yeah. boxing match? I don't know. Become no. the beneficiary Dude, listen, of the I, thing that I'm you're just, promoting? I'm so excited for it, though. I really am. I'm getting, like, it's close. Like, I'm getting giddy. I'm so scared about getting sick or dying before next weekend. Because, you know, oh, I, yeah, I'm going to that too. When yeah, is it? You're is going, it next dude. weekend? Yeah, well, it's dude, next you weekend. For, somebody told you the date today. You yeah, forgot I, it again. I forgot dude, about it. It's literally one week from today. Uh, God, I have so much work so to do. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm also giddy like a schoolgirl, dude. Yeah. I, I love going to Mine's these less exciting because like I, I don't get to, I like being traveled somewhere. I like getting on a plane and flying. Oh, yeah. Well, f- fucking fly, dude. You no, got money. it's, uh, I have to drive down there. It's like a four hour drive. I'm like, no, you don't have to. Oh, I would yeah, rather fucking fly state, right? than go four yeah. hours in a car. You'll be fine. You no, I don't think there was a plane ticket. Oh. Yeah. I haven't. You're like you're, dude. You're a four hour drive away. Fuck yeah. off. That's probably what they <laughs> said. You would think that'd be a connecting yeah. flight though for like refuels something. or something. Or for yeah, like, you should go fly to a different place yeah. and then fly from that. Yeah. State like a four hour flight is better than a four hour drive. Uh, I got yeah. pee so bad. Fuck. Yeah, no, honestly, like, go pee. no. Go pee. Actually, four hour. I probably would rather go do it for, Yeah, I just. I, I think I'm gonna drive. drive. But, and, listen uh, to a podcast. You should listen to our podcast. You should listen to this one. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Hopefully we can get this one out. Yeah. In a, in a week. Yeah, uh, cracking up. We He's were great. We were great yeah. there. This moment where Sam was, was really that quiet. Was. Yeah, I was fucking way too cooked. I shouldn't have smoked uh, that much midway Poob through. Poob interrupted yeah, him so good. <laughs> Let's go. I love how he derailed that whole conversation. Uh, that's my oh favorite my viewers. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm very excited. I'm I'm excited to see you, feel you, smell you. You know, there's a different. There's like your, you know, people you see online. Then yeah. there's touching them. Then there's feeling yeah. them. Touching them. Who's the best them, touch you've them. met? Look in their ear. So far. 
Well, not Brian. He's not a hugger. Yeah. Um, Brian recoiled when I hugged him oh, at the yeah. airport. Um, honestly, bro, I don't know you, you like you that. Like even a, like even a snake Devin, drawing back Devin, for a bite. not much of a hugger. Like I, I'll get up in there and I, I warmed smell up him. to it now. But. Devin's kind of standoffish. Yeah, yeah, he gets he's, a little like, Ugh. He even yeah. kind of like walks a uh, distance yeah. from you if your breath Omid, smells really bad. Omid and I are. You know, yeah, Omid's hug. a hugger <laughs> for sure. I would say, you know, I think Aqua had a very warm embrace when I met him. Also, Stolt actually is like, he hugs exactly like my uncle, where he's like, pulls you in. It's like a, like, bang! He like, pulls and you in and like, boom, boom, boom. boom. He, yeah, he like, real tight. Mm -hmm. tries to you. break your spine. Yeah. Yeah. But in a way, it's like, I'm human. You know, he reminds me, yeah, I'm still here. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like putting a cut down your arm or something. It's like, yeah, I still feel. Yeah. And so he actually really likes Stolt hug. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Maybe those three, <laughs> if you want a short answer, those three best touch, best smell, Omid, because I ended up copying his newest clone. <laughs> oh, hero. Huh. Oh, shit. Hero by, um, I don't remember, Burberry. Uh, <laughs> smells great. <Burberry. laughs> smells great. I smelled it one day when I was yeah. at his house, and I was like, what's this? Bought it next day. Okay. Now I've been wearing it since. <laughs> Versace. Gone. Eros Flame, gone. <laughs> Hero. How cool is that? <laughs> what a cool name for me. People say that about me, and I like to wear that. So get ready to smell me. Get ready to taste me. Unless I die or get sick, which I'm very gotcha. scared about, like I said. <laughs> I, I, I just need I I deodorant. Should I get some? Should I get, should a get some cologne? Uh, uh, you should find your fragrance. Yeah, yeah make a new make one. A Brian, I only get, Try to get, to I only get excited every so often, and when I get excited, I'm like... You know, yesterday, I would have been fine not waking up. Today, oh, boy, that would really <laughs> that really ruin my plans if something were to happen to me. Mm. If, you know, I were to be obliterated. I'm going to the bars tomorrow. I'm not going to. If anyone gets, if any, some guy could literally put a piece of dog shit in my face. I'd go, my bad. I don't want to get. I don't want to get in a fight where a guy stabs me or something. You know, I'm, I'll you, be cool. You see that father that was with his <laughs> baby funny. and like, some guy was like vaping. He's like, hey, dude, could you oh. vape over there, like, away from my kid? And the guy I shot know. him. Yeah. yeah. Oh, him my down. God. I'm not laughing. I'm still laughing yeah. at the piece of shit yeah. in the face thing. I'm not laughing yeah. about the no, guy getting shot. It's great. Shit can get tragic. No. Yeah. Okay. So it's best yeah. if, if people are a, vaping in your baby's face, putting shit in your face. You take it in stride, yeah. you know? There is yeah, a, you there, there, are, more, yeah. there are a lot of road rage incidents around here where people get shot. Like, um, you There's might, a famous one recently, this... Mystery of a guy getting gunned down in his driveway. They have no idea why. My turned out road rage. Mystery. Turned out a guy. He cut some yeah. guy uh, off. Yeah. He found Dude, out like uh, months later. And I drive around here. No one. Everyone drives fucking fast as hell. Every you swerve around. You know, everyone's Mad Max world. But like my my ex's dad was a prosecutor. And was like. Ugh. Like when I first time I met him, he's like, "Don't like honk, <laughs> yeah. don't like, don't get." Yeah, yeah. Dude, people like, will get mad like, behind that. I was like, "Yeah, I live in this part of the city." He's like, "No, oh, whatever you do, <laughs> like, drive me yeah. cautious." And since then, I'm like, "God damn!" Like someone like rear ends me, I'm like, "Go on past, yeah. pass me, my bad, yeah. my bad. See you later, see you later. It's Beautiful scary day, out there, man." But I also yeah, I road rage fuck. a lot, but very silently, you know. So mm. I get, I'm yeah, like, you just yeah. curse in the car. You I know? get very frustrated yeah. with people if they cut me off or slow. Or, I had a guy, dude. Not my fault at all. I don't. I can't remember if I talked about this last podcast. Probably not because we had guests. A, a bitch cuts me off in an intersection. First off, you can't do that in an intersection. You can't do that when we're going through light. Instant. Oh, absolutely dead not. Stop. No. She slams on her brakes. I'm like, whoa truck behind me you know they of course they're double lifted they got their fucking mirrors out oh, of course yeah 20 foot wings truck yeah. nuts they have to like swerve yeah. past me and go out they they're like you know right in front of me we get to the next like light later the lady in front of me still is driving like a fucking idiot like crazy we get to a light Jeez the guy in the Christ. truck is right next to me both of our windows are down. Like, I'm not even thinking about the guy. I'm thinking about, I'm like, oh, this bitch. Meanwhile, he's in his car like, oh, this bitch looking at me. And he did, like, probably what's the coolest thing you could ever do to a person. He waited for the light to turn green. And they went, fuck you. And then he, ro he tried <laughs> yeah. to, like, roll coal into my car. Like, <laughs> like shot black yeah. dust everywhere. And then, woo, shot out. And ran off and i just like <laughs> stayed fuck i just looked straight i'm like this, yeah, fuck. Like, this is just some typical bullshit dude this is horrible and i like 
want, I never wanted death on someone more in my life than like crash. Because he lost control a little bit and then kept going. Oh, like classic, crash. classic. Yeah. Like crash. I wanted, yeah. I wanted him to hit a pole and explode. Yeah. And I even like, shit, I don't know what it is about I me. Mean, shit like that throws me into <laughs> such where I'm like, I'm cool. And then I think about it. I thought I went to the dentist. They're talking about, oh, we're going to have to pull your wisdom teeth. I'm just in my head. I'm like, what if I fall? thinking him? about that. Yeah. And yeah. I get out and I go on the road. I'm like, what if I like, what the fuck? Like little shit like that. I'll, I will just micro like latch on to him, but be like, what? I should have fucking killed that guy. <laughs> like, oh my God. Yeah. I, you know, I'm not like, I should kill that guy. Uh, but I'm like, what, like, what, what could I said? Like, what could I thrown in his window? Like, could I thrown like a, a cup of hot coffee in there or something? No, I never will do anything about it, but God, I'm just like, why the whole drive home? I'm like, that piece of shit, that piece of shit tried to shoot coal into my, he tried to roll coal into my car. I don't think and I've ever gotten mad. Like, and, he, and he waited in the until car. he was out of the way. Really? Too. Oh, oh man, my god! No, I, I, like I've while driving, you have never been mad in a car. No, no I, I used to. I used to get a man. I'm very calm. White knuckled, like on my steering wheel, pissed Rage. off. But it was just like because of work stuff. It wasn't. Yeah. I've yeah. had nothing to do with like someone. I've never like gotten super mad at how somebody else was driving. I, the, you know, what my biggest irritant while driving is when someone breaks the rules of the road to try to be courteous. Where they're like, "Oh no, like you come on this way." I'm like, "Fucker, this is a four way intersection. Like you got yeah. here first. You go before me." Like there's I don't mind that. Rules. I feel like a princess. Yeah. No, you, you fucking yeah. do not alter the rules. Oh, you're you. making yeah. things right. confusing. I'm probably gonna get fucking t bone now because you're you're like trying to be courteous or whatever. Just I don't gun it straight for their car if they <laughs> wave me on. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you, them, dude. Die today, just bitch. do it. Like it should just be yeah. something that you just you just. There shouldn't be like any issue. If someone's coming in my lane or whatever, Abby will do this shit. If there's a slight gap between her and the car she in front and someone tries to ease that, in, I'm just like, oh, you're trying to get in. So I slow up a little bit. I'm like, yeah. that's a tight squeeze. Yeah. Get in there, buddy. Abby's just, Abby will speed up and close it. Like, oh, like, oh, who are you yeah. cutting in front that's of me? Fucking, that's fucking like, it's not a lunch line. Asshole, dude, it's yeah. not a lunch line. We're just <laughs> yeah. going. I don't. Yeah. yeah. But, that's fucked up. Or like, what? You won't I let should, people merge dude. or something? Yeah. Like, like she'll, she'll fight, Yeah. She'll go out of her way to like fucking no. just annoy dude, people. I hate people that get really close to the car in front. I, you ever in a car with someone and they're like fucking tailgating yeah. someone? I'm like, I'm sorry. You don't you have like. to me. I'm like, what? I'm going like 20 over the speed limit. What do you want? Yeah. Tailgaters are fucking me to die. Oh, and people that like uh, assume that their reflexes are like John Wick or something, I'm like uh, they're not, dude. You, you're gonna I'm John rear Wick. in them before you <laughs> can, yeah. before you can hit the brake. It's not gonna happen. Did you not yeah. take driver's head? You know how fast you're going, how yeah. long it takes to react. You need nah. like hundreds of feet or whatever. Or but in their thought, yeah. their mind, they're like, oh, like Three. whatever distance oh. it takes their car to slow down, my car is gonna do the same. So we'll both slide yeah. to a stop together. No, no, it's not going to work like no. that. They're going to hit a brick wall Never. or something, yeah. and then you're going to go careening into you're the back of their car. You're going to shoot them into the back of a semi, and they're going to be killed, <laughs> yeah. and then you're going to live <laughs> yeah. with that. Uh, yeah, that's, uh, I hate, I don't know. I, li I don't like when I'm in, some, like, when someone else is driving most of the time. I don't even like driving, but I'd much rather yeah, be nervous. behind the wheel. Yeah. I have decided, like, Abby's like, all of a sudden, oh, I really like it. You're starting to drive more. Like, if, because I usually I have driving. her drive. Yeah, she's fucking insane, dude. She'll just like tailgate people and like, get angry. And she does like a lot of this, like, like hand up, like, what? Hello? Yeah. Like, just the hand. Dude. I'm like, the hand movement is enough to get you shot in the face. Yeah. And me <laughs> shot yeah. collateral yeah. damage. Doing this? Yeah. I'll kill you, yeah. bitch. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and she's, and by the way, we're in a state where very soon, yeah. It is Everyone. going to be That's legal to just carry a gun regardless That's of any paperwork. In Indiana already. How did yeah. Indiana beat Florida? Oh, I have no idea, dude. Anyone. You need a goddamn you need a license special. and registration and proof of insurance and all that stuff to for drive a like, car. But just for concealing, but a right? Gun? You can just walk out the fucking door with. Yeah. Uh, I start carrying mine in a fucking like chest rig. I, yeah, I want to get like the detective <laughs> things. Oh, yeah. that would be cool. That would cool. be cool. With two little revolvers. Is that even easier to no, take No, they just out? look no, badass. If you so have those, people know you need business. when you take off your jacket and they see the straps, yeah. that's yeah. cool. That's, that's badass. Cool. Oh, that's yeah. classy. This guy's yeah. carrying. That's classy. Yeah. You got a little like yeah. windbreaker jacket type combo. Take yeah. that off. Put it on a rack. A nice, a nice fanny pack with the bullets, you know? Bitch. And there, by the way, there's gonna be a cigarettes. lot of people in the audience that are like, they're gonna be like, "What? Sam don't like guns, Sammy? You know what? I, dude, it's not that. Listen, we pack. That, that that is not the problemo. <laughs> you know what the problemo is? 
So there's a lot of like Forrest Gump level intelligent people <laughs> that are now going to be armed. They have access to and it. And there, there's yeah. the amount of like shootings where it's like bad guy or like public shootings or people like blowing off someone else's head for a traffic violation. Yeah, that's going to go up a little bit. But more than that, it's going to be like people having access to guns, owning guns, carrying them around that haven't even taken that 30 minute tester course where you have to take it for the concealed carry thing. <laughs> And th- just go to the shooting range, dude. There's people that are like ha- checking the fucking guns. gun by looking <laughs> yeah. down at it already. And they're supposed to be Clean people that Q-tip. are trained. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, There's going to be so many uh, like just kids shot at in homes and stuff because they're just, you know, having guns laying around like assholes because everybody can have them now. I don't know. I don't think you should uh, let stupid people have firearms. And that. Or cars, weird, or vote. Yeah, I was gonna say the car thing. Well, when I was when I took or driver's ed, I was like scared of driving because of like or a near a near accident. You're yeah. Of them. Yeah. <laughs> Rally them up. Yeah, yeah, you're starting to get into a dangerous territory. Yeah. 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 First you thought it was because I was liberal, be. but now yeah. it's because I'm extremely fascist. Nah. These are the people I want to exterminate, and I don't like them armed. Breed them you out of existence and kill them. Yeah. Kill the leftovers. Yeah, Minsa and above. Everybody else eradicated. I, I, it stuck with me when I was younger. When like I got really nervous about driving because I got I'm like almost like a fit. I almost killed my current roommate and one of my best friends mm. in driver's ed because I like swerved in the the ditch and then I overcorrected. And there's like a fucking Mack truck coming at us. I was Hell like, yeah. ah! you know. It almost got bad, and then it, I blew a stop sign right after that because I was so <laughs> rattled. And for like a year, I'm like, I don't want to oh, drive. I don't, and my parents yeah. would be like, but there's like so many people that are so much more stupid than you that are on the road. I'm like, that doesn't make that me makes feel it worse. better. Yeah. That's what they always say, though. Yeah. Is like, you can drive. There's a lot of people that are really dumb that drive. And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. No, like, they're on I the road, like I, dude. Yeah. I'm an incredibly defensive it's driver around. now. But I still drive, you know, fast. I drive a little... You know, that's but I'm, my, like, constantly that's, scanning yeah. everything. Like, I... So I'll never get a motorcycle. That's oh, what I kept yeah. telling my brother. I was like, yeah. do you know how many fucking insane people there are on I've the road? thought about it, but I, sh- I kind of don't now. It was know. a phase. I just don't want to be smeared into the road. It's not worth it. And my brother just looks miserable. He just pulls up places. He's like, it rained. <laughs> See, I don't want... Yeah. It's cold. I'm cold. It rained. I don't want to get smeared in the road, but I do want a little cross and flowers on part of the highway for me. Uh, yeah, that'd be cool. Well, just ride picture. your bike. Ride your bike. Because oh, then they put, the, they put the bike and, the and they spray paint it white. Yeah, the, yeah. yeah. And then they put the flowers too. That's really badass. And this is my favorite teddy bear. That's wholesome. That's fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, my bad. What, karma's going to get me, guys. Don't worry about it. No, no. Okay, I'll be taken care of. Now you're going to get sick and yeah. or dead before Clash. Uh, you just know, just know, dude, if I died before it, like, don't be like, you lived a good life. <laughs> so excited. So yeah. excited for Greater Clash. <laughs> No, I'm gonna. My, I will not be able to move on to the next realm. I'm. I'm. I did not realize that was so soon. You have gotten me all in a fluster. I'm like, that's all I'm thinking about. I gotta get I so much done. I gotta get so many things done. Check your blood pressure. No, nah, I don't. Your blood my cuffs pressure upstairs. Right now, yeah. Cuffs upstairs. Fuck. Yeah, I, I don't all let right. that come down into the calm zone. The calm <laughs> zone. You know what I'm gonna do right now? I have like. Big ass like sliding glass doors, like the the side of my room and the the other room in there where my living room area is. I'm gonna get some goddamn blinds or something over it, so I don't feel like I'm in an aquarium. And I'm gonna sit down, and about thirty minutes before I clock out, I'm gonna like go in there and just like jerk off, meditate, probably turn into jerk off <laughs> sesh every time. But yeah, I'm yeah. just, I'm just oh, gonna yeah. try in to a soundproof room. Just sit and uh, appreciate just. Um, <laughs> You know, being alone in my mind without checking my phone or having music or and editing. And the patrons. And the patrons. I'll think about them. I'll think. You have to ground yourself for yeah, 30 I'm minutes. Yeah, ground my... Time I think out. there is value yeah. to getting... Clocking out of work and then driving home. And, like, just yeah. being able to Bro, decompress to, in the car. You need to maximize that time, shit. Start yeah. taking poops with no phone. Start taking poops with no but electronics. Yeah, but how do I watch TikTok? And you get... And poops with no then electronics, but then... More, uh, you know? You just think. I just think. I, well, I so had a statue about it. I taking a shit like this. Thinking. No, that's that's I, actually I a almost... good. That's a good. My poops would be quicker. 
My legs yeah. wouldn't fall asleep. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't have to walk around like a exactly. cripple around my house, leaning I up against that. the wall. I hate, I yeah. pooped. I yeah. pooped till feet asleep almost every time. Now. Every time, so. and then and then you have to. You know what's coming? Ten seconds before it comes, you're like That's the tickle the phase is about to come. With my, my you try yeah, to fight it, but you're like, like well, one more. Do I sit? Do I, do I just sit still? I or do to I the move? nearest couch or chair, dude? No, you gotta like, well, you gotta run to the nearest layable. I like object. that's the that's the great debate. Yeah. Like, does it go you're, away quicker if committing. you fight through and move nah, your legs? Fighting over? through it, yeah, yeah absolutely. Not, or if you sit really? super some still, people, dude. I you almost there's don't feel some it. fuckers that'll like stomp the floor. Oh, I just no, that's psychopath so fuckers. I've seen people do that. I'm like, what the? Hell? That's fucking insane. You gotta fight. Oh god! It. You no. gotta fight it because you I just, move them. I, I dude, so I, I move them. Yeah, I'll go stand. I, I, act like I, I will stand my leg. still and just and be I, like, I can't exactly. move a muscle until what? all the blood is back into my. What do they call it? My what, yeah. what are you you're fucking crazy? What do they call it? Your foot's falling asleep. Yeah, you gotta fight to stay awake. No, you gotta no, no, move no. Your fucking no, no, toes. Okay, no, no. Here's uh, here's the problem. When you're sitting down on the toilet. The the seat is cutting off the circulation of your legs. Just standing up, it's yeah. gonna recirculate. Well, then you do dips on the toilet. Yeah, <laughs> and you move, you it's, kick your feet. It's gonna recirculate like once you stand up. And I'm so saying, you just fully commit, but then I, you're getting even more asleep. I just feet. stand up, and then I just don't move a muscle. Just don't move and until, yeah. and, but it never works out. I try, and it's like. Either, and then, well, and that's then the why you have to wipe through. standing up so yeah. you can start getting some no, blood. No, no, the tickles up. always happen. It's just that when you're not moving, it doesn't. Yeah, they don't bad. tickle as or much. Or if you run to like, yeah, stomping like the tickles. You, you like the tickles? It's the worst no. part. No, it's horrible. No, I don't like that's, it. Yeah, it's fucking but, sick. It's like torture. But I've realized it does help if like mid shit <laughs> oh, stop, you get up. I'll tell you anything. Yeah. You know, someone just straps you to a chair. You can't move your legs. This is torture. This is horrible. My feet tickle slightly in a weird way. Oh, the worst. Have you ever had it where your arm really falls asleep? And when you, I've yeah. had it where I had, I thought I had a stroke earlier in this episode. You, there's a moment where I feel the side of my face. Oh, half my face was like Jesus numb, and I was Christ. like, oh my god, never, what the dude, fuck? I've never had my face fall asleep. What the, what the yeah, fuck? What are you talking my face has never been that awkward in my life. Split right what down the middle, my face saying? got numb. That sounds that like might, a stroke. That might have been yeah, a stroke. Yeah. And then I couldn't, I couldn't speak, even though I really wanted to. I knew I had a stroke, and yeah, you straight up like. Like half his face is all fucked up. It looks like it's a sailor. How it works. It's crazy. Yeah. But I mean, I, I've had it before where I wake up and it's like I roll over and it's like, it's yeah. like wow, this is what it feel like to have no arm. Like, it's just it's just not there. And it's dead weight. And I'm just like, oh, it's scary, but it's also kind of exciting because you're like, whoa, this is new. You know, I love a new feeling. I love a new taste. I have had my leg fall asleep so much while pooping that when I got up at the end, it's like, you feel like you're not putting any muscle into yeah. your ankle. And I'm like, I could be breaking my ankle yeah. right now and not know because oh, it's scary. that asleep. Like, I can't feel shit down yeah. there. Oh, my Achilles, I have a <laughs> feeling that yeah. it's been severed. Yeah. Uh, that, yeah. No. Got to. I'm gonna have to have. I'm gonna have to be put under for my wisdom teeth later this month, and I've never had anesthesia, Lucky. and I'm very worried about what I'm gonna say to those doctors, those uh, poor doctors. 2016 poop might. I'm come gonna out. wake up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I'm just gonna wake up and be like, "You want to follow a good podcast, man, <laughs> yeah. motherfucker? What's up? Make sure you don't do not talk to your family uh, at all. My family's like, you want to stay yeah. over and like we'll take care of you. Get away from me. Get away from me. <laughs> No, I honestly think I'm going to like maybe leave my phone or do so. I don't know. Because I feel like me in that state, I'm going to be like, this is going to be funny to like post. <laughs> it is gonna like, be I'm a just going to post a story yeah. of me like going mouth all fucked up. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to really be In loose. the operating room, you're like, I have to take that funny <laughs> photo of shit coming out of my asshole yeah. <laughs> right <Yeah>. now. <laughs> yeah. Don't put that thought in my head, dude. That's why I've just never had yeah. a sensation. I don't know. I like so being very. I start like being shitting in, in the operating room. <laughs> Take a photo, dude. Yeah. Thank you, dog. Thank you. <laughs> Put that in my ass. Put that in my. Ass. Yeah, God. Uh, yeah, no, I, I, I have to like stop myself because my 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 mind just goes places. It's, I get dark you, quick. Yeah, but not it gets like, dark real not quick. Like in a, yeah. Super. Well, it's like it's, stop yourself from it's what? Edgy, not in like I'm gonna say a slur, but it's like I'm gonna say the most extreme like <laughs> version this of shit this. their pants and came and like yeah. I'm pussy or, like I'm yeah. just gonna I'm just worried I'm gonna yeah. be incredibly vulgar. Yeah. 
or incredibly inappropriate about like them and me or like you know i don't know like i don't want to talk about like banging my dentist or something like i i just don't know <laughs> i just like i'm gonna just say something horrible yeah but they can't be mad at you and that's their they, job they can they, be yeah, but yeah, it's like if you go it, under floopy. anesthesia and then you immediately start asking them about like hey, oh, i hear a lot of dentists kill themselves you can kill yeah. yourself you little sad yeah. man yeah you know he's not gonna do a good wisdom yeah. tooth job on you yeah, he's gonna yeah, yeah. well it's already done fucking at that cut point. in there <laughs> Yeah, I don't. You don't you start. Do you, you think you get anesthesia, wake up, and then they <laughs> do the yeah. wisdom teeth? No, they, 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 they start doping they you up. Loopy. I mean, they're, you, you, so you, they you you they like count back from ten, then you're asleep. Oh, wake I, up. I, yeah, I figured they kind of eased you yeah. into it a little bit more. They just no. clonk you out. That's awesome. They just clonk you out, and then they uh, do all your shit. Uh, and they, uh, they have like I just read the pamphlet. And the the guy hooked up to your vitals, so they can. There's like a chance you die. I'm like, if I died that way, I guess that'd be pathetic. Nice. But also pathetic. Once pathetic. again, yeah. like that billionaire that died trying to out. get his penis bigger. Pretty funny. Yeah. That's horrible. What if he dies from that now, dude? Yeah. I don't want to die from that. I mean, I don't even want to get him out. You're jinxing it. I want it. to push it off forever. What if, you get, what if you get brain damage from it? It'd be funny. It's like you lost well, your dude, wisdom you get, to you. Yeah. Get bought, you get Like a thing that's happened to people <laughs> more commonly is like you lose feeling in the bottom. Because they said one of them is impacted against the nerve. They're like, we'll be careful. But if they uh, nick it or bruise it, I'll lose feeling in my jaw. And they're like, it can last months. And I'm like, what the? What would that even feel like? Like back. you feel like your jaw's asleep yeah. for that long? Like that would blow. Can I eat grapes? Like, what can I eat? My favorite fruits or what? Probably, actually, mostly that's, my favorite. Yeah, fruits. that's weird. My dad had like quintuple heart surgery or whatever, and. <sighs> They nicked they don't a, fuck that up. Oh, they did. They nicked a vein, or not a vein, a, a a a nerve or whatever. And so, like, just the sides of his fingers on one hand are kind of, and like, they don't have as good of like motor function on one hand. Is that why and, your mom left him? Nerve? Yeah, basically. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, the two important ones. <laughs> yeah. He was telling me he was like, I don't know when it's gonna come back. It's gotten a little bit better, but. Like, I wonder if it's ever going to come back fully. So he was really researching, like, nerve regrowth or whatever. And they apparently only grow, like, very small distance per year. And so if it's, like, they got yeah. they got severed and then separated by an inch or whatever, then it ain't yeah. ever happening. But if they cut it... And what if, well, if I live to 150? Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. just weird that Aww. you can get it severed and then all of a sudden get it back years later. Yeah, what a connects. what a joy that'd be to wake up and go. Oh, I we were it. talking earlier about blind people getting their eyesight back and being like, like pissed off about it. Take or it no, out. no, it was people being able to hear or something like that again. Deaf, yeah, deaf, I was yeah. thinking like, what if, what if like Stevie Wonder like gets his eyesight back and then he's like, oh, like <laughs> fuck, <They suck laughs> my wife's ugly mad? and my house sucks oh. or something. Yeah. Like, <laughs> he has no idea like what he looks like and shit. He's like pissed Dude, off that about was famous. it. Yeah. Uh, I couldn't imagine you wouldn't be the most happy you've ever been in your life. But <laughs> yeah, you could be incredibly yeah. sad. No, he'd be yeah. mad My wife's as fuck, ugly. Dude. I've been given the gift of sight. No. <laughs> I'm black. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Claw him back out. I don't like my decorations. <laughs> no, he's honestly, I've always wondered, like, does he have a stylist or something? Because he always looks fresh as hell. And... He's Probably. always he's always got like great outfits and stuff. It's like, a, but it's a very distinct style. So that means like somebody dresses him in a very distinct style. Maybe he feels like yeah. <laughs> he yeah. looks like he gets all of his goddamn shirts from that. I think you should leave place. <laughs> Dan Flash. Uh, Dan Flash. Yeah. Dan yeah. Like very great, complicated. Very complicated patterns. I mean, I wouldn't say that uh, Stevie Wonder shirts are like. You know, in like the four to five hundred or like a thousand dollar price range, or more of like the four or five hundred dollar price yeah, range. Like they're complicated, um, but they're not basic, crazy. So. You know? Not gonna drive mm. you crazy looking at them. Yeah. The medium package. Yeah. Um. Anyways, yeah, you want to wrap it up here? This one's yeah. long as shit. I want to uh, go to bed. Be, yeah. I'd rather be broadcasting. Yeah, than podcasting. Yeah, they had to pee. You had to pee for an yeah, hour. It kept, me, a little. it kept me awake. Mm. I've been going to last night. Too. I went to bed at nine o'clock. Whoa. No, I, w I went to bed at like 10 I woke up I, I drove my kids to school And they and oh. the oldest one was like Dad can you do this every day I really like this I, I like oh you more than mom I love you so oh. much I hate mom she sucks <laughs> Yeah. Jesus Christ She's a bitch and when <laughs> you're not here she yells yeah. at us 
Yeah, if she's the worst. No, I can't do bitch, this. I like waking up a little yeah, later. I like waking up late and not having yeah. to deal with you, actually. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird how that is. This was the best day of you're, my life, Daddy. Can you do this again? Yeah. Absolutely not. Well, you're fucking killing me. <laughs> yeah, my blood my pressure this morning pressure. was actually really high. Yeah. So, no, that's yeah. not going to happen. Uh, <laughs> Now we we were listening oh. to uh, the Frozen soundtrack, of course, on the way to school with the windows down. She's like, "Dad, lower oh. my window and crank up the music." And so, in a like little car seat, yeah. you know, with <laughs> the back windows always go down, but like the last four inches of glass doesn't go down. Yeah, so she's like, the just the wind is hitting the top of her head, basically. Yeah. Dude, that's perfect. perfect. Lasting into the unknown. What yeah, you should get song. a convertible and be a cool dad. No. Uh, nah. She get a Ferrari. <laughs> yeah, she get a Ferrari. Yeah. Put them, make them share a seat, and just get Dude, 200 oh, miles. You know what we should do? We should strive for a gamer house next to, uh, near a Swift. Gamer car. There near is Swift. Near, near Swift. Near Swift. Pretty convenient. This is uh, England we're talking about, folks. Fucking nowhere, UK. <laughs> yeah, it's like right yeah. outside of Wales. There is a uh, castle awesome. going for 2.5 million euros. What is that on a forty-year mortgage? Uh, probably yeah. like not much. Like I think we should. Yeah. yeah. All I'm saying is cool. like way better than oh. Hassan's house, and I think it's like. Imagine same price. my shit in a castle. I know awesome. it would look incredible. Yeah. It would be perfect. This and place was like space. ten thousand square feet. It was huge. Uh, we could whew. totally get it. We could totally That'd be get sweet. it. It'd be a good place for you, Abby. I gotta go for the weekend. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you just don't tell her. Yeah. No, I'm I mean, I, I figured. I meant like we all pool our financial oh, resources yeah, and bring would. all of our friends and stuff. There looks like there's plenty of room. Live it's a like castle. a bunch oh, of you acres. Use it like your bat cave, where you're like, Abby, I'll be right back, and you fly, <laughs> you fly over to Wales. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I was thinking yeah, like we'd live there, like a, a big bit. weird commune of Americans. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, yeah. it'd be like the Wrangle Star. And, and when you get mad, you'll be like, I'm going to my wing of the castle. Yeah, the oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. Yeah. The West Wing. It lo- it just looks very regal and badass. You should send me that listing. I need to <laughs> take a look at my, it. It's, yeah, it's, yeah. Pretty awesome. I it's pretty awesome. Well, I need to check my That's like a good life goal of mine is to end up in a castle. So oh. I'd love to check that. And you know what's cool is case. you have awesome neighbors too because when we we're the, the Google Street View car, uh, somebody driving out in front of this castle. I'm assuming one of the neighbors, maybe the person that lives there, I don't know, was driving a Ford GT40, oh. like down the road. It's badass, uh, yeah, like very badass car. Cheap yeah. fucking wealth bastards. <laughs> yeah. That's actually yeah. really cool. Yeah. I thought I was gonna ass, see like, like a guy fucking yeah. a sheep and the guy oh, oh, the you or something. Uh, yeah, yeah. Down the road. Uh, you okay? You okay? <laughs> <laughs> no, that yeah. Send me that listing. That's very cool. Yeah. Uh, there, yeah, we, there's an insane amount of castles that have been actually like turned into homes. We, that, can we find one in like North Carolina or Colorado or something? Are there any castles? There was one there? in like Oregon or something that was yeah. kind of cool, but that's about it. Yeah, uh, not many castles like in the in U.S. Michigan, Oregon, like a Michigan Lake Michigan fort or something. What was the one? What was the one that Bizzle was showing us? It was like fucking. It was, it was Missouri or something. It was like a fortress it was or a castle, a, a castle in, like, in, in Missouri, Kentucky, Kentucky or something. Okay, yeah, it was like it was some crazy some place. place where yeah. I was like, castle. I wouldn't live there. If I think it was Missouri. Me. I thought it was like Missouri, wasn't yeah. it? Some shit like that. Some yeah, state that nobody would ever want to go to. Yeah, they made that as like a fucking <laughs> trap. Yeah, like look a yeah. castle, castle in the worst state. Made in 2015. Yeah, yeah, fuck that. At least it's not in Arkansas. Uh. You can mm-hmm. say. <laughs> Yeah, it's a great, a great state motto. It's the yeah. second worst. Yeah. <laughs> Not less. You, you have one guy to shit on. No, because Arkansas can shit on Mississippi. Yeah, Mississippi pre Katrina would would beg to differ. <laughs> you think? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, it's a shithole all the time. Yeah. I don't, really I don't think I don't think Katrina really made it worse or better or anything. I think it's just always been the better. same level of shit. <laughs> I don't think anyone's ever argued it better. I think uh, Louisiana definitely got fucked over. There there was a, actually a show about that that I think my mom used to watch on HBO back in the day. One of those classic shows that it's only on for like one or two seasons and then HBO cancels it. Crowd at gang. No, it's not that, but it's some guy that it's he a does end up killing himself because he's like oh. new orleans just will 
never be the same. Like Mardi Gras yeah. won't ever be the same after Katrina. It doesn't matter like how much the city comes back. It's just not the same. Grow up. <laughs> yeah, grow, grow up. Some yeah. things change, dude. Don't kill Get yourself over it. Over it. Yeah. yeah. Damn. I love uh, partying and seeing titties so bad. I'm gonna kill myself. Yeah, dude, there's I a lot of history. There's a lot say. of history in that city. I it would be wah, sad wah. to see it like wiped out though. All those people. Oh, you know. the jazz. The jazz <laughs> the is jazz. dead. Okay, Fuck. jazz has yeah. been dead. All right, jazz. Yeah. I knew that from yeah. watching uh, Whiplash. Didn't take a hurricane oh, for that shit. Whiplash and what La a movie! Oh, that what a director film. loves some jazz. Never yeah. seen it. Never seen great, Whiplash. Great great movie. About Whiplash. Uh, yeah, you talk about it so you much. Need to see I it. So good. It. I just re- I watched it for like the third time recently. I just pop in. Let's do a viewing every party. once in a while. <laughs> pop in the last scene. Oh my god. Oh, so, yeah. The last scene the is last, that good. He's all like. Oh, that's a spoiler. What the fuck, dude? I love. Oh, yeah, that happens he a couple times. Catches it. <laughs> yep. His no, fingers dude, what bleed. The fuck? Yeah. <laughs> You're yeah, and, it. and then I also watch La La Land because the last scene's like the same thing, but he's like, dilly, 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 dilly. he's on the keys. Yeah. Great. Do you agree with that one? Sam? I haven't yeah. seen La La Land. Sam hasn't seen La La Land because he's a fucking pussy and he doesn't respect that director. Even who's though he the, likes Whiplash. Is this the same director as Whiplash? Well, no, it, it's not that. I just, oh, is it? Oh, I haven't I know, had I'm time to watch it. <laughs> I know. I thought, oh, I, I thought have a huge list. Li- it's on there. Gosling. It's on my list of oh. movies. My list of movies is wait long. Wait for me. Wait for me. We can cry together. Okay, wait. I'm going to I'm gonna put... <laughs> wait, is it on here? Watch it at Creator Club. La, 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 la. I am not going to... This is valuable time hey spent with yeah. homies. I am not going to yeah. waste it watching a movie. I'm bringing my TV, and I'm bringing... I don't think you appreciate La La Land enough. Fuck you. Oh, God, bring your iPad so and just have it yeah. downloaded, dude. I also, I need to see. Yeah, I have a, I have everything, everywhere, all at Every, once. On oh, there. great movie, yeah. great movie. I, I haven't seen that either. I wanted to watch that incredible flick. Yeah. And then I think this. What about the Lego movie? Uh, <laughs> North Man's on here. No, I love oh, the Lego great movie. Mario North, movie. North Man, great movie. Yeah. North Mario movie, movie came Apparently out. Apparently, it's not you know? bad. Yeah. Yeah. What, what is Mario movie? movie? Yeah, it's supposed really? to be good. I. I I didn't even think about it. I didn't know that. Yeah. And then apparently I just have uh, some porn star's name on here. Yeah. <laughs> so I was just like, remember that oh, for later. Oh, what's the name? Yeah. What's the name? What's and the name? that's the end, fellas. Uh, <laughs> that's the end. Uh, We're getting out of here. Uh,